really hate, why does it always not start up the stream that is being hosted whenever I start streaming? It's so retardedly Stop. stupid whenever I start streaming. Mm -hmm. I don't want someone else stream on at the start of my stream. It's not how things work here. And with here, I mean, it's not how things work properly for me. But hey, that's just for me. But that's how it's gotta be. <coughs> what? Oh, I don't know what I did wrong. I opened up the wrong tab, or I didn't right click, which I should have done. Go. Really? There's no one else that I've been streaming on this server since yesterday, since I started streaming. That's very odd. But hey, here we are. Tweet out the stream. Here we go. Turn it down. Open up YouTube. And send a post. Over there. Over there. Eh, 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 eh. Press the wrong button. To create a po -po post, mm -hmm. then have a boop boop from the cell phone that tells me I can control the stream from the cell phone app. But I'm playing on PC, so there's no reason for me to be able to do that, since I have everything I need on the right side of the screen here. And I've forgotten to open up the steam window. That is always a good idea to do. I hope everyone is having a fantastic Wednesday today. As I'm about to start up Yakuza Zero. I've been playing a lot of Fall Guys recently with a couple of friends. It's uh, a really fun game. Definitely recommend it. Hopefully there will be audio on stream right off the bat today. But you never know with these kind of things. Really loud. Sound. Free, I could say use a gamepad. I don't really know that game. 
So, let us continue this save file over here that we began yesterday. Where we met the real estate broker and we didn't take the opportunity to work for him, so... Now we're gonna check on our friend, which I remember not the name of. I wonder if I can go to the high-tech land or the MacBook right now. Oh, I can enter it, nice. We're gonna play some arcade games then. If it's possible, I mean. Nice, they're playing green sleeves. Entertain yourself ten times. I want this one. I wonder if I'm gonna get it. I did not get it. I moved it a little to the side. Well, there's a big boy over there. Try for the big boy over here again. Think I might have got him. I was wrong. But you know, these claw kind of claw machines are essentially scams. First of all, the object you're trying to pick up is usually too heavy for the claw to carry. And of course, it's the f you know shape of the object that's usually you not know, aligned with. Uh, With the claw, it's uh, grappling up ability. God damn it, I missed completely. Also, hello, Ventar X. Welcome to the stream, hope you enjoy. No idea what you just wrote, but uh, I'm sure it's something pleasant. Oh, this is not gonna grab onto anything. Plus, some of these claws, you know, have an uh, setting that will make them either drop the object on purpose or shake the claw preventing it from uh, carrying the item all the way. I'm gonna go for the pink bird instead. Or you know we're gonna fail getting the pink bird. Let's insert some more coins then. And we're gonna try, that's not gonna work, is it? Nope, I just moved it further. Okay, I think I went a little bit too far there. Really want to grab onto the bird's fat. Seriously, I grabbed the hat and picked him up again on his feet. That's too funny. Okay, birdie. You'll be mine now. <laughs> I got the bird. <laughs> Took me nine tries, but it was definitely worth it for that silly little bird. Maybe I want a squirrel too. Yeah, the theme that's playing in the arcade is green sleeves. It was also played in Super Frog for the Amiga 500. I like that theme. Oh wow, we got the squirrel right off the bat. Awesome. Pretty much done with that claw game. That Space Harrier. 100 gen to play. I like Space Harrier, it's pretty fun. I have that on the Sega Genesis collection. 
侵略者どもの隙にはさせねえレッツハリー I'm gonna assume this is just a port of the game. Switch screen type. Insert coin, fire select, invert controls, rapid fire, okay. Kinda of funny playing. Welcome actually. to the family. Okay. Get ready. Space Harrier that um, has a really good team that's in Bayonetta. Oh yeah, it is. It is this uh, game has a team. It's actually playing right now. I love that part of Bayonetta 1 where uh, you drive on a motorcycle and this team is playing. I'm sure you had an airplane, but I'm not wrong about that. Hello, this is you. Welcome to Stream Hope and Joy. Yeah, we're playing Space Harrier. Dragon. Don't reach that. Get ready. Dragon. Okay, now I'm not really sure how you hurt this guy. Well, the plan's not killed him. You're doing okay. great! Now we're in the east sound. I'm gonna say though that this sound is annoying. So why are we uh, attacking the Easter Island statues? I know Perovius is the Easter Island statue of the Lino Space Harry is the Dyer's Well, I ran straight into that one. Get ready! Well, that was just a good one. Okay. Well, That's pretty bad, oh wow. We're close to the second set of tags! Oh! Okay. Man, the beast is higher. Wait, is that Tingle? Definitely looks like Tingle. That stage was easy. Oh, no, an armor. Okay, the magic mushroom killed us. from the beginning. Quit the space area then. Yeah, I really like the you know, main theme of space area. It's nice. Apparently we can't play the slots though. Hello, you. Hello. Welcome to Sega Arcade, what can I do for you? Change UFO catcher prices. Don't do shit for me right now. Okay, so I can only play Space Harrier right now. Or in this arcade, specifically maybe. That's a bit boring. Would be lovely if we could play more games, but uh, oh well. Sorry, lady. So, we're gonna see if we can enter uh, this area over here. <laughs> Theater Northwest. Did not seem like we could enter it. Unless the entrance is down here somewhere. Hello, 
little sign guy. Oh, okay, the bowling alley was over here. What's the next part of the story? I have no idea. I haven't played the game. What we're supposed to do technically now is go and talk with our buddy. To Can let him know that we're alive. That's uh, a challenge to stop. Let's play solo. I'll play alone. Okay, 500 gen. How many frames would you like to play? Uh, let's play, uh, play 10 frames. Okay, and you're in the game. Got to play some bowling. You can cancel with B, set direction power, position, and select ball. Okay. When selecting your ball, you can choose where to stand with. Uh, okay. A to turn the direction and A to adjust the throwing power. And press before releasing the ball to adjust the spin. <laughs> Seriously, gather ball. Heavy tank. Mm. God damn it. No strike for me. Mm. Not bad though, an eight. I don't think this will hit, to be honest. Huh. Oh, that was a little bit too hard. Hmm. That should have done it. Yeah, there we go, strike! <laughs> Second throw. How is that not an achievement game? Seriously? Probably gonna be one for uh, a perfect score then. Let's go. Actually, let's mm. go fourth one. No, that might be a bit too hard, yeah. Knock it down, knock it down. Oh, so close. Mm. Yeah, that's. Uh, that's my expression to carry you. Yes, I said that. Oh, wait, you left early yesterday. But yeah, I, I like this game. It was a lot of fun. We are spinning around a little bit. Huh. Okay, that was a bit too hard. Yeah. Oh no, I got it. Got a split. You. Spare. Spare me your sympathies. Okay, I think a two spin should do it. Hmm. Close enough. What I like about it, I like the brawling. The story mm. was kind of neat too. Uh, the little I've seen of it so far. I'm gonna go into the gutter if I don't uh, spin it a bit. Mm. Go another spare. Mm. Spare me your sympathies. Two should do it. Huh. Or not. Mm. Let's go with a three. I think that's huh. enough. Might have been a bit too or no that was perfect. You. Spin to the right. Huh. Have a more 
clean ball. God damn it. Should have left it as it was, I think. I think two should do it. Another spare. <laughs> going to go well let's go two of them hmm. having the slightly on the side that's where you should get strikes and roll ah oh, god damn it hmm. I think my record in regular bowling is 120 points we'll do one spin hmm. A spare. You. Let's go with a three. Huh. Might have been a bit too much for speed. Nope. That was. Come on, game. Mm. That was almost a strike. Spin. Huh. Uh, no, that was perfect. Good. Hmm. All right, Cloud. Thanks for stopping by. Hope you enjoyed. Ooh, let's go one to the right. Hmm. That's a good shot. Yeah, there we go. Still right. Look at that, I've already beaten my real life record. Some fictional bowling. We don't need any spin on this one. Huh. Told you. Strike! Yes. Two straight strikes. I can get strikes in regular bowling too though. It's a bit harder in real life obviously since... Uh, you don't have these lines, mm. that was a bit too hard for a spin, I think. No, oh, perfect! Strike number three! Three strikes and you're out! So, yeah, I'm out. Okay, that might be a good one. But it's mm. not gonna be a strike, unfortunately, I don't think. Never mind, fourth strike! Yo. So, 210 po one points, not bad. No achievement for that, really? Do I need to have a perfect game? Is that it? Thank you, lady. And one up for a fight? And one on a fight? Huh? You there, you wanna fight? I guess we're not allowed to fight in a bowling alley. We're not even allowed to go to the bathroom. The ladies' bathroom I can understand, but the guys' bathroom? Not allowed in there either. What if I have to pee? Does the game ex ex expect me to pee in my pants? What do you mean of the game? So mean indeed that I want to leave the bowling alley. Let's see if anything else is open. i entertain myself as much as I can. Let's have try to have a couple of fights as well. Oh yeah, got some goods. Oh, you're gonna enjoy this. Nishimura, you're down. It was all my fault. Yeah, it was. Shouldn't have been in my way, bitch. Let's see. We do have the uh, heroin karaoke bar. I'm gonna try and get to that one. You wanna fight? I'll no fight for you, okay. You're with the ladies, so you don't want to fight. Okay. 
ladies didn't want to fight either. How unfortunate for me. Notice if they look like businessmen, they rarely want to fight. I'm not running. Oh, it's a drunk, okay. Drunkers! Wow, he went down. Quick and easy. <laughs> of course I'm gonna let you go. You were the one picking up a fight with me, you know? Hey drunk, you want to fight? You wanna fight? Huh? I guess you're not a drunkie. How about you? Wanna fight? I guess he doesn't want to fight either. Oh well. I'm gonna head for the karaoke bar. Shot oh. me! Kakus again, right? Or are these just men in black? There are men in black, okay. You know what? Oh, you. Yeah. Good on you there, boy. But not good enough. Oh, I thought he was a guy who could fight. You know what? Okay, now we go bye bye. I am happy that I upgraded it to give me more cash for being defeated though. Oh, is this a drunkard? You wanna fight, boy? Wanna fight? Huh? Wanna fight? What? Not. We're gonna enter the karaoke bar though. We have some karaoke to do. It's 1000 yen per song. Sing solo. Okay, let's put on the music. Do I still only have two tracks, I wonder? Let's see what they got. No, they have more songs now. So let's do Baki... Bakamitai. We are so Kahori. Okay. We have a car puppy up in the corner again. I sing for you. seem like you fail uh, if you press the wrong button. It does give you a window to press the right one. It doesn't automatically fail you. Like other rhythm games where normally you would fail because you press the wrong button. Didn't realize that was a rapid press. We're now sitting there drinking alone. By ourselves. My score was 92! Yatta! 
with four bads and four mistakes. Still became a karaoke king though. Let's uh, try the other songs. I have a cash to spend on, you know, goofing around. Can always go and fight against uh, some more men in black for some cash. As long as I defeat them, you know, they won't erase my memories with their uh, memory eraser thingy. Let's three times shine this time. And let's try lively interjection. Get some more points for that. Oi! 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 Did he try to say sexy, sexy? Wrong buttons, by the way. For some reason, I get the wrong buttons. This is not going well. Nice thing is terrible, though. Not that I would be singing much better, but. Yay! He's saying he's not a very good singer. This was a little bit harder. Shine, shine, sunshine. Sunshine. God damn it. Shine, shine, sunshine. 85. Okay, got karaoke pro. 16 mistakes though. That ain't good, boy. <laughs> Aren't you quite a singer? Customers like you brighten up my day. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Arigatou Don't sing at our bar again. Uh, that's kind of what I'm here for. But he, he wasn't good at singing. He got a nice talking song, though. Do lively interjection for Heartbreak Mermaid. Okay, it sounds pretty good so far. Go, go! I pressed Y on the last one, but. Hey! Hey, hey, hey! Some reason it didn't register. Yay, yay, yay! Got a bad. Okay. Oi, oi, oi! Mosh, mosh! Another bad. Go, go! Mosh, mosh! Beruni. Hey, that one was a bit easier. It's the fast one, so it's a bit difficult. <laughs> Cha -cha -cha I don't even know what that means. Ding ding! And this. Heartbreak Mermaid! That's a little bit harder. Okay, that one must have been better than 85 at the least. Quite good scores. Alright. I'll take it. I may not be a karaoke king, but I'm a karaoke pro, and that's fine by me. 
I have one song left. I think. Okay, rough of love. Okay, we start with a hold. Everybody say, lose you over love. Oi, a kakuso me lose, lose you over love. Yay, 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 hua, 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 hua. Come on, baby. Oi. Keep who go, 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 pretty face. Hey, hey, oh, some reason I always forget where the X button is. I mix it up with the B button some, for some reason sometimes. I'm not sure why. When I actually know it's on the left side. Now oh, I forgot what the Y button was. How weird was I mean? Not what it was. I know what, I know what the Y button is, but I forgot the location of it for some reason there. Everybody say, lose you over love. La 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 la. Lose you over love. That must have been over 90. Come on, game. Over 90. Ha, 91, yes. Our karaoke king, nice. Got 90 plus in rough love. I wonder if uh, we get more CP for that, the other ones as well. Let's uh, try that, see if we can get 90 of the, of the other songs. They were a little bit tougher than the last one, but uh, we shall see, we shall see. Let's go heartbreak uh, mermaid again. Can I tell you maybe a little spoiler from Jakusa 2? Sure you can, Cloud. I know that there's a girl that's gonna be kidnapped sometime in the series. So, uh... Go, go! So there are a few things I know about yay, the series, yay, you know. Yay. Oi, 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 mosh, mosh. Go, go, mosh, mosh. Beruni. Kureta. Oi, 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 ai shiteru. Ike Ike da ze! Chan chan! Cha cha ra cha ra! Chan chan! Cha cha ra cha ra! Sabishi! I know karaoke is a really big thing in Japan. Cha cha ra cha ra! Chan chan! But it's fun to see, you know, even a former Yakuza member. Enjoy it. I 
think um, that was over 91. How is that less than I got last time? I did better this time than I did last time. <laughs> How could that be even worse? You can get experience from food, so what I did was going into a restaurant and eat everything they had on the menu and just got into a fight until I was empty. Hmm. That's uh, a pretty good tactic, uh, to be honest. I wouldn't really call that a spoiler, to be honest. I would rather call that uh, a um, exploit. <laughs> And obviously, the, you know, the experience system is going to be different throughout the different games. I think I might have done the less go, go, go. lively interaction. Hey, 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 hey. Which is why I got the worst score. Yay, yay, yay! Instead of lively, I think I went oi, with uh, oi, the not oi, lively mush, one. Mush. Yeah, definitely. Went with the less lively one. Go, go, mush, mush. Oh yeah, I definitely did the less lively one last time. No wonder why it was so easy last time. That must have been over uh, over 19, right? Sure, I made mistakes, but not many. Yes, 91. Success. So, got Karaoke King on that one as well. Now we only have one more song to be a Karaoke King at. Okay, I'm supposed to entertain myself. 30 time now for another uh, character point or whatever we're called. Three times shine, live interaction. Oi, oi, oi. This one's a little bit tougher, honestly. Yay, yay, yay. Pua, pua, pua. Phew. Sex sheet, sex sheet. Press the ラブサーフィー。イケイケだぜ。君がサンシャイン。輝けさま。うーい。君がサンシャイン。スリーシャイン。イエイ。Okay, that must have been over 90, right? There's no way that wasn't over 90. 94, nice. So we got one character point. 
Welcome to the heroin karaoke bar. Would you like to order anything? I'd like to order some heroin, please. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, let's order some fried chicken. Mm, delicious. It was to my liking. Hello there, lady. Um, I'm already done at the bar. A meal was good enough. I don't need to be go going out drinking. I don't want to end up like the drunkards after all. <laughs> Let's uh, head over to the area over here. Okay, you went up for a fight. There have to be bigger groups like these two, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Video booth at Gandhara, you can watch videos of, of a varied cast of gorgeous girls. As you meet these women in the city under certain conditions, new video content will become available. Search every corner of town and find your dream girl. Okay. We charge 800 yen for one view. Let's watch a video. Which video would you want to watch? I've only got Miku Abeno. So let's choose her. Enjoy the video. Thank you very much. Okay, she's taking a bath, big fucking deal. Oh, come on! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I think it's funny there's a skip option, you know, like... You're a kid playing this game, you're watching these videos... You pop your hand in, inside your pants and your mom suddenly comes through the door and you fast as heck pressing the B button skip it. <laughs> That's hilarious. This video was incredibly stupid by the way. I'm sure it's a real video too. That's the worst part. I did it for the achievement. <laughs> I didn't even fucking know there was an achievement. I was just curious, okay? <laughs> oh, that's funny. A bar, and a drink. Let's go for uh, Vincent's for some pool. Then we can go and fight some at the battle range. I did it for the achievement! <laughs> oh, that's so hilarious. Funny how there's not one for, you know, getting a strike in bowling. Oh, no, no, no. But you definitely get an achievement for watching a quote unquote erotic video. Yeah, me here. I'm gonna fight you. No, I'm gonna fight you. Wow, you did it for achievement! I certainly did! Machine that I didn't even know existed. Where's the other guy? Here's this. Shot at him! Gonna switch to fighting spikes. Yeah, you know, I just hit the air in front of him and then one punch and he's down. Of course he's not human, he's a fictional character. <laughs> he got cheated on Cloud. By the other man in black. He's now retired. Let's order. Ooh, 18 year old whiskey, let's buy that. Fans of Japanese whiskey are on the rise, even overseas, and one big reason for that is this right here. 
Yamasaki whiskies have always been prize winners, but the 18-year-old variety has earned the most accolades. It has an irresistible aged flavor with depth and taste like dried fruit that comes from the sherry barrels in which it has a is aged. This, along with its fragment chocolate note, makes for one full body whiskey. Okay, we got some uh, alcohol uh, knowledge here at the same time. Have you ever tried sake? It sucks. Unless you heat it up, then it's drinkable. But room temperature sake is the worst. In my opinion, only. Anyway. Okay, play some pool. Let's do that. Anytime we pick game, that's not to worry about. I punch a guy for this cash, so. It's pool fun player only, so you can take your time and have fun with it, even if you're not an experienced pool player. You start each stage with a certain setup, and your goal is to sink the object ball in the specific pocket with just one shot. You should try it at least once. Enjoy playing pool in a bar. Would you like to play a standard game? We also offer bets on puzzle pool starting from 500. Let's do a puzzle pool. Yeah, kinda, or you know, put it in the microwave. Let's do the uh, lowest bet. Set camera. Place ball, adjust direction, shooting mode, switch camera, aiming mode. Okay. In this game, players strike the white cue ball with a cue stick so that it hits other balls, object balls, knocking them into pockets. Adjusting shot angle, first select the angle from which you strike the cue ball. When adjusting the shot angle, you can use R1 and change camera angle. You can also press X for an overhead view. Okay. Adjust the camera to find the best shot angle. Shooting. Once you have decided on the shot angle, press A to enter shoot, mo uh, shot mo shoot mode. As before, adjust the shoot power using R or the mouse. The farther back you pull it, the stronger the shot will be. Pressing uh, Back on R or dragging mouse straight back towards you is the key to making accurate shots. Okay. In shot mode, you can use uh, left and blah 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 to adjust the impact point. If the impact point is off center, the strike will put a spin on the ball. It can come in handy at times. Now, let's give it a try. Apparently not. God damn it. That was apparently not allowed. Okay, I'm not allowed to hit the um, the black ball. It seems. Yeah, this game has a lot of mini games. Goddamn button! Why does the camera zoom not? It's not on Y. So stupid. In my, in my opinion. Here we go. Wasn't too bad though. It was nice of the game to give me five tries. Use! Date complete! Dead. Uh, stop here. Uh, don't play. 
So that was some easy earned money. Not that I mind easy earning money. Okay, I only earned a hundred thousand, but I'm happy with with the little I earn. Yeah, we li no, not likely. Pool is not my favorite kind of game on uh, video games. Okay, which type of dart play I want to play? Uh, count up is not fun. Let's do 3 of 1. No. Thank you. Kazumi Kiryu versus Shigeki something. Yikuse. <laughs> Round one. Is he drunk? Seven points, okay. Huh. He went for the sixty pointer up there, I think. Or try to at the very least. Really got a triple twenty? Thirty-four. That's terrible. He got a lot more scores than me this time. Okay, close one, I guess, but only forty-seven points. Really, a bullseye. Isn't this supposed to be the easy one? God damn it. He's gonna win. There's no way he's gonna get less score than me. He only got f what? Ha what? That's bullshit. How did he miss like that? Okay, have fun who sees you. Thanks for being by at the stream. Hope you enjoyed. Yeah, sometimes doors just a thing. Indeed. Good standard doors. They're slightly better than the run of the mill house doors. And I can keep them? But of course, I'm looking forward to seeing you again. Yeah, I might touch right, right back. It's a fun game. Hello, you. You seem to be pretty good at doors. Uh, no thanks. Yeah, it's a shame, but I just want to try it out once. Also, I'm kind of drunk, you know, so definitely don't want to. Let's see if I can punch someone while being drunk. Control seems to be, be a bit off when you're drunk, though. Which makes sense, since, you know, you're intoxicated by alcohol. All your senses are dealt that way, sorry. Whoa. Doing that on purpose though. This guy looks like he wants to fight. I'm gonna fight him. <clears throat> he didn't want to fight, really. What's wrong with you, man? Whoa. Why didn't you want to fight? <laughs> Hello, lady. I don't understand a word you're saying, so. I'm running to this guy. Good man <laughs> Wow, nice knee and kick. There we go, knocked him out. <laughs> oh, another spammer, terrific. 
Ah, oh, thanks, Cloud. You know what to do with them. That's awesome. I was gonna do it myself, but uh, thank you for that. <laughs> I still don't understand the word you say. Also, why is he looking away from her? Kiryu, you're a weird fella. Are you more interested in this girl? Is it she you're looking at? Who is he looking at? Okay, we're gonna fight these men in black. We're gonna intervene. Oh. It's kinda funny that spammers always come in pairs. I like how the guy just, is, you know, magically disappears. Oh! <laughs> Rush stance is really nice, I like that stance a lot. Slightly better toughness night. Thank you for the free item, but I really just came for the money in the fight, so there's that. Still in talks. Okay, we have a fight over here. Oh wow, sorry lady. Hey, I said I was sorry. But you know what? You attack me anyway, so. Okay, don't kick me in the back. It's not very nice. Enemy down. Top gear. You better be sorry. Let's see what else can I upgrade here on the stands. Upgrade making them more scared of me. I think that would be a good choice. Increase the amount of heat gauge rise when you attack an enemy. So let's upgrade this as well then. Of course it's draining all my cash, but uh, we're upgraded pretty damn well. Over here I have heat retention and heat retention damage, okay. I'm gonna wait with upgrade. Now we're gonna go and fight here. Which we couldn't do, it's probably inside of here then. Or it's on the other side completely. Let's go on the other side then. What's going on over here? I really like these golden stairs things. Sorry. Is this one of the special ones? No. Oh, more men in black. Okay. I like how we just took it. That way he got a kick. Or a soul in his face. You're not forgiven. But you have been defeated, so. There's that. Is this over here? Yeah, okay. So let's enter the battle station. And let's have a fight. Hello you. Talk to 50 people. Hello, getting high score can win you cool prize. Would like to see what prize you have. Yes. Okay. 
I told the boss that offering expensive prizes like these are going to ruin us, but he never listened to his stuff. Go ahead and win them all. That will show him. Okay, you believe in me, that's awfully nice. Are those ATM machines? It certainly looks the part. Oh, here we go. The Super Gold Rush course is... Oh. Okay. Uh, no, we're not gonna begin with that course. We're gonna go with one of the cheaper ones. I'm not really that advanced. Uh, no. I'm gonna do the beginner course. That one is out of order, okay. Let's do the beginning course then. Cut to bestiers. Oh, it's a baseball ring. I thought it was a fighting area, okay. Three strikes, you're out. That game was kind of fun, though. Admittedly. Although I thought this was a fighting arena where you get to punch people, but alas, I was wrong. What else can we do in this town? We've been there, we've been bowling, we've been at karaoke bar. We have the arcade down there, we have Mahjong parlor, and we have the Shogi parlor. Everything else we've done, I think. We've been at Vincent, we've seen an erotic video. We've been at the battling center, okay, so it's basically us south of, south of town then. Hopefully we get some good fights along the way, get some extra cash. See, speaking about fights, here's one now. I like fighting the men in black, they gave me a lot of cash for fighting them. Yeah, battling center. It sounds like, you know, a battle arena, but... Oh, it said batting. I've read it as battling all this time. No wonder I was disappointed. <laughs> okay, okay. I get it. I get it. I'm just red. I read what I wanted it to be, you know? Battling center. Now oh, we have some more fights against Yakuza. Well, I'm ex Yakuza now, so. Uh, I'm fighting up you guys. Not so bad. <laughs> Kicking you off the curb. Not bad, then. Oh, he fell to the ground quickly. 
something over here but ah. hey, is it you? Ah. Oh. 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 Okay. Oh. there's somewhere else someone in trouble I couldn't find the guy though ah. oh. But uh, we're gonna fight against a couple of delinquents. Fortunately, though, they're not gonna give me a lot of money. That's the worst part about them. Okay, congratulations, you got me down on the ground. You know what I do about that? Not you, though. Down on the ground. Tag me next time. I'm gonna go play that at the arcade. Hopefully there's something else but uh, Space Carrier here. Oh! We have Outrun. Outrun is a fun game, too. Or I've I've played Outrun clones rather. I've never played the original Outrun. Like I've played a couple of Outrun clones, so they're usually fun. There's a game for the NES that's similar to Outrun though. Brake, shift gear, accelerate, and see it and Get ready. Because I have the rush dance to help pick them up when uh, Rush down there. So, uh, I'm not sure why we're driving so fast. Is it too impressive, girl? I don't think she's very impressed about. Uh, I think she's impressed by this, and she's a retard, so... Especially when I'm driving to buildings and shit like that. Wow, I've literally played a clone of this game. Checkpoint. But the different roads will take you to different levels or you know stages. I think it's called something like Turbo Chase. The, uh, the clone that I'm talking about. It's essentially the same game too, but that's the worst part about it. I guess that the graphics are a bit more polished. Oh wow, the graphics are on there. Even the festival, huh? Driving the car, I mean. <laughs> we really broke the car there. Okay, I made it to stage two. Yeah, I literally own a game that is an exact clone of this. That's kind of funny. use bikes and stuffs because I'm using the rush thing that's why
Hello. Yes, I will say. I want to change UFO catcher price. Okay, so we have run out here. Let's try to get a lizard. Oh, this is pillar lizards. Oh my god. I was about to say, am I gonna get a double price here? But nope. That was not the case. Oh, this one's not gonna work, right? Oh, it did work. Okay. Oh my god, I got a double price. Thanks, Cloud. Let's see if we can get one of those Dragon Ball ghosts. Okay, I couldn't. That's hilarious, though, you know, getting a double price like that. Yeah, it looks like a Dragon Ball ghost. That thing. Let me just go into my chat real quick, like this. Which, of course, didn't allow me to because uh, Twitch app is retarded. I did not press that thing that just opened up. Okay, it was the Twitch chat, but it was just incredibly slow. There we go. So, uh... We have the Mahjong parlor. I'm not very good at Mahjong. You wanna fight? Okay, no. It's no hoping we won't fight. Sorry. How about you then? You wanna fight? Fight me? Okay. He's not want to fight. He does. He doesn't want to fight either. That's all right then. Let's enter the Mahjong parlor and see if I um, can get it. Orchid Palace Mahjong. At Orchid Palace Mahjong you can play at tables with varying rates of participating in ranked matches. Tables are beginner, low rate, immediate, medium, blah blah blah. The price to play and the strength of the opponent vary depending on the table. The more skilled your opponent, the more you can win or lose. To put in rank 9 you pay 50. Okay. Hey, want to play with us? Just to warn you, we all suck this game, huh? Because it's only 25,000. Let's try it out. Advice, being drunk will make fights happen more often. But won't it limit my fighting capacities as well? Yes, we just have no idea how much drunk works. That's why I'm terrible at it. Honestly, I have no idea what I'm doing here. They all look like they know what they're doing. But I think that's just part of their tactic to trick me. Boom. 
Because I have no idea what I'm doing. Sheesh. Let's place this one then. I don't like this type of minigame. I don't even know what I'm doing, so. complete to be the first complete of 14 tile hand. This hand is typically composed of four groups of oh, three tiles and one pair. That's too boring to read. What are the hands then? No points hand, pinfu, all simples, sanyachu. Identical sequences, okay. Whoa. Did, but sure, it works, I guess. game did you prepare for if this didn't suit your taste? Tales of Symphonia was my backup game. It was supposed, or rather, it was supposed to be my main game, but uh, then you requested this game and I like this game. So, you know. Chief. Oh, it became a draw. Still don't really understand what I was supposed to do. Okay, that's how I quit. Let's quit the game. I didn't get this one. Uh, the first one. Although I'm gonna do, I'm gonna stream it after this game, I think. Once I'm done with the yeah, Crystal Zero, I mean. But yeah, the first Tales Symphonia. I do prefer the GameCube version over the PlayStation 3 version, but it's the PlayStation 3 version I'm gonna do. And the reason why I'm choosing that version is because I haven't beaten the PlayStation 3 version. And that's you know, the main reason why I'm streaming it. Or going to stream that specific version, I mean. Plus, you know, Tizenphonia is one of my favorite games. Which is another reason why I want to stream it. <laughs> Let's uh, pay one million dollars. A yen, I mean. For it. Matsutake To be the king of mushrooms, okay Oh, oh yellow guy I think I need to sneeze Enter this area. 
Yeah, the game I did first on my channel. That is correct. I did two of my favorite games on the channel. Okay, I'm not paying attention to anything of this. Play a ranking match. Kawaguchi. I don't even know what I agreed on. <laughs> I just pressed the A button. Take back, okay, peace explanation. Uh, okay. More promoted pawns, pawns goes first, okay. Is this like chess? Chess, all right. I'm assuming this is the king that I need to guard. Never very good at chess. get this game. It's fun, but I don't get it. It's like a weirder version of chess. don't even know what I played. What did I play? I have to agree to something, I don't even know what I played. It wasn't a fun game. Okay, it was kind of fun. I just didn't get the rules all. all. <laughs> I don't know. What did I play? Shorten, okay. I don't know what that is, but... Uh, oh. Like a uh, chess, but uh, weirder. I'm not good at chess either, to be honest, so. Uh, you know. 
I don't think I would ever be good at a game like that. Let's uh, save now that we've done a lot of um, a lot of mini games. I'm gonna head up to the uh, shrine and upgrade a bit, if I can upgrade. That is. You want to pick a fight? Maybe not. I wonder, do I have alcohol? I think I might have. I have Falsberg, let's drink that. Ooh. Yeah, I want more fights. Fight me again. Oh. Yeah, this was... Hello, thugs. Oh, it's you guys. Okay, maybe you weren't the guy with Bruno. A shame, because I really want to fight against Bruno. Not enough, uh, not a lot of money for fighting these hooligans, but... You know, cash is cash, and a fight is a fight. Doesn't matter too much who my opponent is, as long as I get uh, into a fight. Oh, it's you guys. Just a bunch of hooligans, you know, I'm Execusa. And this is gonna be... No, oh, I thought you were knocked down. That's a shame. Curb Stomper, nice. Help five victims around town, nice. Oh, silver plate, thanks for that. Was that why they were giving you a hard time? Because of the silver plate? That's really stupid. Is this the only shrine, by the way? Might be. Yeah, that is the only shrine, okay. Hello, clown. Can I get anything else? No, nope. okay. Okay, let's use the character points or whatever, whatever they're called. Get the card watcher accessory. Mr. Shakedown would like to take a nap in the park. <laughs> Don't know who that is. Let's upgrade this. Use card watcher and dash for long to recover more quickly. Okay, good. Got a few more upgrades that way. Let's see if we can pick a fight before we enter. Yeah. Looks like these guys are ready for a fight. Yeah, they are. That's right. All delinquents out. <laughs> I just knocked him down pretty badly. Nice. What did the other guy l escape? I'm running the wrong way, I just realized. Let's see if we can see someone that wants to pick a fight though. Oh, we have some men in black over here. They definitely want to fight. You know what? I want some nice knockouts! That really gains me money. Let's uh, use a bicycle to make Cloud happy. There we go. He really biked out of that one. <laughs> you can't believe me fighting you, really. No, it's a karaoke bar. I don't really need to do any karaoke. We are gonna go up and go through the alley though. See if we can pick up another fight up here. This is a shopping area? It looks like an alley. No, we're... Oh. A hooligan, really? What? 
Take the bike home! <laughs> what? Okay, he's dead from that one. Okay, I didn't know there were item knockdowns. Got some really nice knockdowns there. Especially the one with the bike. I'm pretty sure I killed that guy, but... Uh, you know what, there's a, an alleyway here that leads to a dead end. Maybe I'll get ambushed there. The empty lot was just past these stairs. I shouldn't be seen at the scene of the crime right now. It would be bad if the police are still around. Better keep in. That area is the one that's worth so much money for the Yakuza. Really? This area looks like shit. This area on the other hand looks nice. It's a shame I can't enter it. I'd love to enter this club here. Yeah, me here. You're, dr you're drunk, right? Yeah, I'm a drunker. Just knock him down right off the bat. Oh god. No real fight. Just a quick knockdown. Oh, I'll do it again. Of course you will. Boys like you never learn. But you should back out of from a fight. When you see a guy in this kind of... Can I change costumes? Change my equipment there at least. <laughs> I have a gun. <laughs> Stun can't. Photon blade for the time. Okay. Don't think I want to use the those DLC items. I don't really understand what that sound is good for. <laughs> Maybe it's because I'm standing still too much, or... Oh, here, okay. You're calling me a dweeb, really? You know what? I'm really looking for a fight here, so... Where's the snark? It's just a bunch of delinquents, really. Don't earn yourself a bigger beating with this. Okay, I'm out of power, really. Well, this is compact, so free land is hard to come by. Yeah, sure, but still. Leopard print cloth coat. Put that in the box. I'm gonna have four uh, story points still. Another one of those Pew! things. I think it's important, but I don't know why. Cafe, I don't really want to enter a cafe right now. Those guys look for taxes. Okay, this is a sushi place, I don't really feel like eating sushi right now. I do feel up to have some store section though. So, uh, Let's see if we can enter this building. Oh, it's when the story point comes into the minimap. Thanks for letting me know, Cloud. Okay. You 
だがこれで俺はきっちり道島組を破門になったそうかそれじゃおやさんのことは大丈夫ってことだおやさんのことは、まあ、俺の濡れ衣が晴れねえ限り道島組はおやさんに責任かぶせる気でいるなんでだよお前がもう組を抜けたってのにかああただそれでも一歩前進だ道島のダイモンが外れた以上こっから好きにやらせてもらう Okay, we're gonna play. Hey, Kruse, another visit. We'll speed him up. Give him a break. <laughs> or, or not. Let's not give him a break, actually. So, j o r g e Kashiwagi san ni mo t s t a i n e t o i g o z e Yeah. Ora Tojo Kai kara hamon s a r t a ningenda. Mo Kazamagumi no jimisho ni wa hire me. Kashiwagi san ni wa. Oh, my kara t s a i t i g o o e nani tenda yo mizuk se na. いいからこう言ってせめてものけじめだ錦きっちり筋は通す筋ってお前は何も悪いことしてねえのによだったらお前この後アパート帰るだろ俺もすぐ行くから詳しい話はそこで聞かせてくれじゃあ後でな being part of your c r e w s I thought we're Lived in a certain Yakuza house. Guess not. Should have more for tonight. From here, it'd be fast to walk north through the hotel district. Okay. Oh, so now they're blocking off. Oh, it's a story mission, so that's why they block things off. That makes sense, actually. Hey, you. There a problem? Yeah, would you seem to think you can just walk by me without a word? Do I know you? This isn't your turf. Or should I have to tell you anything? Is that Bruno? I'm not here for chat. If you don't want to get hurt, you we'll leave the, all the cash you got and get lost. Okay, he's a, he's a burglar. That wasn't Bruno, I'm afraid. <laughs> so this is a shakedown. You should pick your targets better. You don't have a single yen for chumps like you. I guess we'll do this the hard way. Hope you're insured. Mr. Shakedown. Oh! It's the guy that unlocks, okay. You know what? Ouch! That hurt. Ow! Oh god, he's really packing a punch. Yeah, I should probably switch that. Back up. Okay, he tanks my hits. Huh, <laughs> you're not half bad. I let you off the hook this time. What? If I travel with someone like you, I need to change my training regime. Time to bump up the intensity, which is going to be expensive. If I want to save up that kind of money, I got some shaking down to do. Is this gonna go and rob other people? Damn it, get back here! Hey, you okay, man? Yeah. You just had a misfortune of meeting Hiroya Egashira, Mr. Shakedown, they call him. Mr. Shakedown? Yeah, he'll go after anybody across his path, and then he takes everything they've got. You seem like you can hold your own in a fight, but that guy's on a whole different level. If he sets his sight on you, you run for it. He's definitely more than your average tough guy could handle. Still, I wish somebody would come along and beat all the stolen money out of him now. What? Did he get you too? Oh, wait, did he get you too? Damn right he did! Took my whole holiday bonus! I knew I should have made a beeline to the bank with it. You'll be careful too, next time you're sitting on a stack of cash. Oh, and rumor has it, Egoshira's not the only Mr. Shakedown. And that they aren't just a Kamurocher thing. Stay sharp if you ever get, go out of town. Mr. Shakedown, huh? He was insanely tough. I probably haven't seen the last of him. Better keep my eyes peeled. 
Mr. Shakedown won. If you lose to Mr. Shakedown in battle, he'll take all the money you have. If you spot him in the street, the safest tactic is to run away before he can rope you into fighting. If you can beat Mr. Shakedown, you'll claim all the money stolen from you. The amount he's carrying varies at different times. If you, if you can take him down when he is especially flushed with cash, you can make back more than what you lost. Okay. I should just head home for tonight, that was the plan. Did he get some health back? Man, his home is all the way up there, really. Hello, you. Okay. I got a free pocket tissue. Oh, are you drunk? Are you ready for fight? No, it's, it's a goon. Alright. Oh wow, this goon is angry. <laughs> I really like the face, Tom. It's so brutal. Okay, that wasn't... Uh Particularly interesting fighting techniques there. You are forgiven for now. No more, Mr. Shakedown. Let's see if we get to find any more men in black. They usually have a lot of cash on you. Do you really stand here and smoke with that face of yours? It ver looks very low textured. Low textured faces, or people with low te textured faces shouldn't smoke, you know? It's bad for your low textured face. Sorry, 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 sorry again. Sorry, <laughs> wow, <laughs> it means push her down. Let's see if I can get any more men in black. Okay, we have a guy over here. He's definitely one ready to be a fault. Hey, bitch, you ready? Huh? You ready? Okay, you're not ready. All right. Looks like we have Yakuza over here. Oh. Oh, that was to save. We're kind of like Spider-Man with all these, uh, you know, people needing help. <laughs> His friend didn't do anything to help him, how nice of me. Decent amount of money, but Men in Black usually gives you a lot of money, so there's nothing bad with that. Oh, Switch Watch. Nice. I know I can sell a couple of these items, but uh, they really want to. Not yet, anyway. Would be a good idea to save before I head to my apartment, though. There we go. Oh, nice, we have some more men in black first. I'm not really sure why you want to fight me, but I'll happily destroy you. Okay, nice. An extra 400,000 yen. Not a bad deal. Of course I'm human. It's not like I'm a spider Batman. 
you know, combination of Spider-Man and Batman. You can travel to Kiryu's apartment from here. Call it a day, actually. Might as well progress the story. So we make some progress. Feels like I haven't been home in forever. Way too much has happened the last couple of days. Okay. So uh, we have another area here. Let's enter the door. Man, he has a lot of noodles, though. Order, Kiryu. Come でもお前が生きて戻ってきたの見てから、また<笑> ああ、だがまだこれからだ。若頭補佐の3人のうちの誰かが空の一粒を手にすりゃ。風間の奴さんは組を追われる。それに俺の殺しの濡れ衣も晴らさねえと。殺に命じけられたらもう終わりだ。
今時の不動産周りは金の足掴み競争だ得体の知れない連中が群がってるけどその中でも立花不動産は札付きだ東条会本家も連中を排除しようと思ってるらしい、okay, so、in war with each other. そのくらい厄介な連中ってことだけどそいつらがおめえの味方につくとなると面白くなるな信用できる相手ならの話だ。なんで俺を引き込もうとするのか、立場の話だ。なら、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まキリュウ君抜けるとキリュウさんは人で覚悟の上だ。Not sure why it gets so incredibly dark in my apartment. I know it's getting darker now around this time, but come on now. The next day. Maybe Nish. Nishiki's right, and I should accept Taishibana's offer, but I need to, more to go on before I can trust him. Tachibana real estate. I really like you know the text that pops up on the screen like that. It's nice. Actually, let's not do that. Go to Kamarucho. Yes. I want another battle arena uh, or battle stage. I mean, those are fun. Where do the game want me to go now? The game wants me to go... Nowhere? <laughs> Maybe I need to grab a taxi then. Maybe that's what the game wants me to do. To grab a taxi. Where? Oh. Well, I, I didn't see them. Come on, man in black, you can't wear black in the middle of the day in the shadows. I won't be able to see you that way. And you know, you wouldn't really like it when I can't be able to, when I'm not goddammit able to see you. Are you really gonna cheer me up over there? Thousand easy cash. Toughest light, okay. How much does an upgrade cost here? Thirty million, god damn it. And two million. Reduce the rate the heat gauge drops over time. I don't think I want to upgrade the rush uh, stance. Reduce the amount of heat lost when you take damage from an attack. That would be pretty good. Mm. Yeah, let's go with this first. Bzz, bzz. Let's use it to go around town. Oh, we can go to Tokyo Pier. Let's go to Tokyo Pier then. We haven't been there yet, so let's uh, head over there and see what uh, we get over there.
Hello, you. No. Oh, wait, the pier. Isn't this where we can fight? I think it might be. Sea fishing. We can fish, apparently. Uh, let's start fishing. Gonna wait for a fish to go and grab it, or what? This fish will. Fish is here, it seems. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Grab onto the hook, fishy, 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 fishy. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Latch onto the hook, Mr. Fish or Mrs. Fish. Seriously, you're not gonna take the fish? But I mean, hook. How about you on the left then? You go and grab the hook. I seem pretty scared of it. I screw fishing, fishing wasn't fun. fishing okay so all I seem to be able to uh, do at the pier is fish I was kind of hoping I would be able to fight but since you know that we have this area over here so maybe you can only do it during the night Shishuku Southwest. I think it'll be best. <laughs> Racers wanted, what? Where? New pocket circuit racers wanted. Want, want, want to have a race? Huh? Hi there, how about some pocket circuit racing? We're looking for more people to join. Pocket circuit, what's that? We race motorized model cars are on a track, everyone's doing it these days, young and old. Cars are small enough to fit in your pocket, that's the name. Pocket sized race cars, that's not fun. Yeah, it's all the rage right now. This is the pocket circuit stadium where races are held. I know people do marble races these days. Give it a try sometime, I'm sure you'll be hooked. Pocket circuit, huh? That could be fun. Maybe I'll stop by later. Maybe I'll stop by right now. Entertain myself a little bit. With some race car driving. So this is the Pocket Circus Stadium. Looks like a hopper spot. Oh! Ah, what do we have here? Is it your first time at the Pocket Circus Stadium? Why are you dressed like a racer? This guy is decked out like a Christmas tree. Uh, yeah, I heard this was a new craze, so I came for a look. 
You're completely new to the slot car racing, huh? Nice to have some fresh blood. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Pocket Circus Fighter. I handle registration and race commentary. Commentary? For the races? Of course, it gets everybody really amped up. So what's your name then? I'm Kazuma Kiryu. Well, buddy, I'll call you kazuma -kun. Um, kazuma -kun? So, You don't mind if I call you that, right? We like to keep things informal around here, so everyone's kun or chan. So, kazuma -kun it is. Mm. Uh, okay, if you say so. You're a complete newbie when it comes to Pocket Circuit, huh? Yeah, but I heard a little about it outside. You race more tried model cars, right? Oh, buddy. That's right, but racing them's only the beginning. Customizing cars is the real... Where the real action is at. Customizing cars? Yeah, winning a race after customizing your car with all sorts of component components is super fun. You can buy components from the Pocket Circuit Stadium shop over there. Oh, so that's what the car parts are for. You might want components around town too. You can make your very own speed demon, Kazuma -kun. Okay, I get the gist. Sounds like there's more to this than meets the eye. I understand why it's so popular now. There are rumors about some components available at the high-end dream machine and vending machines too. If you ever want to know more about Pocket Circuit, just say the word, I'm here to help. Okay, got it. Thanks, Lumin. Hope to see you back here. I'll be waiting. Pocket Circuit does sound pretty fun. I should ask Fighter more about it sometimes. We're gonna customize uh, our car. If that's even possible. It's a slot car shop, part shop, but I have no idea what I should buy. Better talk to Pog. Okay. Hey, Kazma Kun! Right, Kazma Kun. You decided to keep Pocket Circuit a shop, huh? Uh. Yeah, it looks fun, so I thought I'd try it out. Awesome! I'm glad you stopped by, Kazma Kun. Having a new opponent's race really gets my competitive spirit going. Uh, okay. To, com co yeah. to commemorate your Pocket Circuit debut, here's the card to get you started. You're giving this to me? Sure, it's all yours. Pocket Circuit has its fair share of grown up fans. But most races are kids. I'd be stoked to see more people our age getting involved, so think of this as a little incentive. <laughs> huh. Well, I can't, say no I can't say no to that. You got the golden tiger. You got slick tires. So we get a really good body, a car body. But we get really shitty other items. Color, though. Let's have a race, I'll show you what Pocket Circuit is all about. Sure, sounds good. Boost, stabilize, okay. Ready? No! Let me introduce the slot racing. It's simple, slot cars are placed in lanes and the one to finish all the laps first wins. But you don't just stand there and watch, you can give your car a boost of speed, for example. Try it now, press Y to use the boost. Now, that's what I call speed, but the number of times you can boost your car is limited, and it makes it easy to fall out of the lane. Just like that, your car is about to fall out. Press B with that rapidly to get back on track. Whew, that was close. Pressing B to save your car only works when you have energy in the top left guard, though. So now you just race to the goal line. Feeling impatient? You can fast forward race. Press left L trigger to fast forward. Now that, can save you now that can save you a lot of time, huh? That will give you more time for more races. I won! 
So that's it. You know all the basics now. Talk to me anytime you need a refresher. Okay. Sounds a lot of fun actually. That's really just about Calvary. If there's ever anything else you want to know, just ask. We're about the same age, so I can tell you a few things from experience. Okay. Friendship with Pocket Circuit Fighter. You got to know Pocket Circuit Fighter. Interacting with him will gradually fill the Friendship Gorge. You can check this Gorge status at any time in the completion list. Build your friendship with Pocket Circuit Fighter and see what happens. We have a business page on me. They're selling slot car parts here, maybe I'll check it out. Shop for parts. Okay. Many different things here. Let's uh, just buy one of each, to be honest. Arigatou Collect five different frames, okay. We got one more CP. Five different gears, one CP. Um, that's my car first. So I did get a full star body or frame. Okay, there are different stats too, nice. This gives me less balance grip and acceleration, but increased speed by two. This one's even worse balance. balance. That and then I have worse cornering by quite a lot. So why would I want to get this then? New ultra rocket frame because it looks cool maybe but let's get the best motor. My acceleration with speed increase by a lot. High capacity battery, but it doesn't really gain anything much for me. I have perfect cornering, more or less, so. Uh, let's get the flames on. Let's make it purple. Purplish neon purp neon pink wheels. Okay, we're pretty much uh, finished then. With the customization, I mean. Let's enter the race. Yes. So we have super good grip now. Should be fine. So. Oh, okay, I get it. This is the only one I can do because I have 21 points. Course out of the day, so I go in the Konokos. Mina, Thais like a stericana. Looks like a really cool track, though. Tanum does it.俺の豪烈な隊が。立ちはだかる大バルは何と、ポケサーでの勝率8割。これは8割だ。注目の数間君は黄色レーンだ。みんなスタンバイしているな。手を振れるなよ。それではレースを開始するぜ。レディー。
little bit too quick for his own good. <laughs> I made it too fast, god damn it. I had a maximum grip though. Let's customize my car a little bit first then. Better balance, how do I get better balance? Question. I essentially have the best balance I can currently get. This works better. Maybe we need more, you know, better balancing stuff, but oh well. We're in the green lane, so. みんな一律系。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。
Oh wow, I'm not gonna make it. No, I didn't make it, no. So I finished third, that's terrible. Well, you can't win every time, uh, Kiryu. Okay, I increase his friendship now. Mm. Okay, so if I win races, I get to buy more stuff. That's that's actually pretty fair, I'd say. There's suddenly more expensive, eh? I can't afford them all. But oh well, we have bought more stuff. We're gonna leave this area and we'll uh, drive some more miniature cars at another date. It's gonna be awesome! Oh, also, why I'm doing this? It's kinda dumb. I can't do this. Silly me. Forgot about it. That I could do it like this, I mean. Oh, that was kind of stupid though. I forgot to open up the... There we go. It's a clear advantage being able to see the chat, after all. Let's see... I don't really... No. We can go to the parking lot and fight now, good. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, I can hold the A button. Whoa. Been listening on these people. Oi. I still haven't found the president of Toshibana Real Estate. Our boss ain't a patient man. We've been keeping him waiting for a long time. Hmm, who are these guys? <laughs> I'm sorry, sir, but the guy's a shadow. Doesn't leave a trace. The informants in this town can tell you anything, except what, when it has to do with Tachibana real estate. Wait, none of them? Then what Tachibana's bought them all? Huh? I'm saying he's paid them all enough to keep quiet. If he's really that kind of guy they said he is, it's possible. <laughs> Shit! Wonder if there's any way to outspend him. Um, with what money, sir? We don't really have any. Uh -huh. Then get the hell out of here and find me some more information. Forget the informant. Go hit one of the businesses he's bought out or something. Yeah. Yes, sir. Okay, so that's what we're supposed to do. Technically. Oh, I can enter this area now. I finally get to enter these golden stairs. Nice. Irashimase. What? Okay, fair enough. I don't even know what this place is. Please keep in mind that if you leave our club, you'll need to pay. Okay, it's a club. Maybe we can do some dancing. Hey there, wanna show off some sweet moves on the dance floor? Yeah, dance solo. That's what I'm here for. Awesome, which song do you want me to put on for you? Friday night. Ah, it's Queen of Passion. <laughs> Eurobeat. Gonna make her mine. Gonna take you home. Ah, we'll do. Uh, I'm gonna make her mine. Let's do the normal. Disco, basic rules. To dance at the disco, press buttons in rhythm with a song. Use uh, the left analog to move your character avatar to a square with the next input icon. And press the corresponding button shown when its frame overlaps to a square border. Okay. As you move your avatar, you'll see a number of steps it takes. The more steps you take, the more points you will get for the next correct input. So try to make as many steps as you can on your way to the next input. 
Square marks all recept on won't be counted again. Okay. This sounds boring. Uh, oh, no, 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 do some amazing disco dancing though. This game is taking place in the 80s after all, so... Oh! I'm terrible at this. It was difficult. Hmm. He booed me out of the stage. Come on. <laughs> it was difficult, all right. 2002, I'm embarrassed myself. Just like in real life. <laughs> oh, good times. I'm gonna walk up on the dance floor and then leave this area. Gonna continue this road. <laughs> Didn't hear people up here though. Oh, there's oh. something over here. <laughs> you got Marina Shishra Hashi type A card. Who are you gonna call? Not her. Water refilled, really. Did have some water left. Oh well. Go. Full bottle of water. Wasn't there someone who wanted a fight? Do you want a fight? Oh. 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 These guys are over here though. No. No one. Guess I must have missed out on them because I picked up the card. Oh. That's a shame. But I, I knew that, you know, if I would have end up, ended up fighting those guys, I would have forgotten about the card. Wait, what's... Oh, it's Vincent's, okay. Listen to this guy. I'm bummed the cafe blend closed all of a sudden. Them being open all night was a huge deal. You heard anything about it? Think the guy running the place just kicked out? Nah, they just moved shop. They're across from Mac Bowl, we are in Theatre Square. There's a new sign up. Oh, really? But wait, why bother moving it if it's only a few blocks Ooh. away? They got chased off by those guys. Touch upon a real estate. I hear they did, didn't leave the guy much choice. The next I'm gonna save up is for the f 420k one. Really? Alright. 
<sighs> Whoa, seriously? Well, that's a relief, I guess. I'll have to hit the map behind Theatre Square next time. Whoa! Hey, curious, huh? Hmm? Well, if it isn't Kamoji. I think those are real pictures, actually. Thanks again for before. So, this is where you do your thing, huh? A punch at artist, was it? Yep, that's right, that's me, that's my job. I couldn't make much sense of Barker's explanation. What is it you do exactly? Oh, rules are simple. You knock me down or knock me out, and the prize money is yours. <laughs> Prices double the stakes, customer puts up 10,000 yen, I don't have that kind of money. If they win, I give them 20,000. Half of that's the upfront fee, so we only need to fork over the other half. Pay commodity an amount equal to the entry fee in advance. The limit time limit is 60 seconds. If you get knocked down or knocked out, you lose. If you hit the challenger, you also lose. What? Mm. Frustrated drunks, the, that's your best bet. Come at you in a nice straight line. Easy to dodge, punch all the garbage too. I advi I'd advertise to everyone I see. So much challengers are guys looking to blow off steam by hitting someone, and not tough guys looking to win some cash, huh? Mm. Oh hey, if you was interested. Why don't you try it out? We could bill you as my apprentice. Why would I want to be your apprentice? Mm. Truth is, nobody ever took me down before. Words getting around, so I get more gawks and less challengers. But with an apprentice, I reckon that change. They want to see if they could take you on, so I'd get tons of challengers again. Makes sense. But I was then too kindly to being made anyone's apprentice or pupil. I told Bacchus the same. Well, if I have has any pointers to give you, I'll be sure to let you know. I make a pretty good teacher. Strange guy, but this Kamoji seems like the real deal. I could learn more about that fighting style. Sure, why not? Tell me how this goes. Alrighty, check out this price list. Customers get to choose one of the courses. 100 million yen course. Some of these are pretty pricey. Mm. Plenty of people rolling cash around here, so I figured I might get lucky. One guy picked a million yen course once. Mm. All very well if you win, but you have to pay it out if you lose, right? That's a pretty big mm. gamble. Yep, that's why I turned down the million yen guy. He looked a bit too tough to risk it. Then why even have these those courses? It attracts challengers. No way a homeless guy like guy the likes of me could pay out, right? Anyway, you don't seem to earn that way, so Barkus plan sounds best. Barkus had a plan? What was it? We start by looking for a ten thousand mark. Then if that works out we shoot for a hundred thousand. Dodge our way through another bout and we set our sights on a cool million. He's dreaming if he thinks that will work. I suppose 10 million yen and 100 million yen will be next. No way anyone will take you up on the bet that high. Never know though, right? Don't knock it till you try it. So, who pays out the prize money? You, of course, Kiryu san. Got to make sure you're covered if you ever lose. If everything goes smooth, the money will come flying in. Fine. Alrighty, let's start with the 10,000 course. Just give me a shot when you're all ready with the money. Don't slack off with your training, neither. Don't have any cash. It's only a hundred thousand. I'm only a thousand. That's uh, Let's see if we can pick a fight somewhere. It's a million yen, really. Hey there, want some mushrooms? Huh? Mushrooms? <laughs> I got some great ones. Can you put a smile on your face? What do you say? Mushrooms that will put a smile on my face. Sorry, I'm not interested in that sort of thing. Come on, why not give them a try at least? You won't find finer mushrooms anywhere. Yeah. No, I'm good. Go ask someone else. I see, that's too bad. Hey, you! Is it true you're selling mushrooms here? <laughs> <laughs> a customer. What kind of mushroom are you looking for? Mm. Um, I've never done them before. I don't know much, so can you recommend something? <laughs> <laughs> it's rare to find someone new to mushrooms. All the ones I stock are great, but let me think. Mm. How about enoki mushrooms? They're in season now. Oh. Enoki? Enoki? <laughs> I get it. 
You give him regular names and nobody catches on, huh? Smart. He's looking for psychedelic mushrooms. This guy is apparently selling legit mushrooms. In a shady alley for some dumb reason. Huh? But an oki is an oki. What do you mean? I'm looking for the kind of mushrooms that'll make me feel good. Well, my oki mushrooms are top quality. Eat them in a hot pot and you'll feel good all right. Huh? <laughs> You're making fun of me because it's my first time? Want your face rearranged? No, I'm not making fun of you. And I don't want my face rearranged. Wait, this mushroom dealer. Yes. Oi. Hey, that's enough. I get the feeling this guy is not the kind of mushroom dealer you're looking for. Huh? I don't get it. And who asked you anyway? Fuck off. Wait, hear me out. If you're not gonna shut your mouth, I'll shut it for you. Oh, we got into a fight. Nice. Street hooligans. He shouldn't be alive. <laughs> what the fuck? This guy's ridiculous. Um, thanks for helping me. Yeah. Well, I was just defending myself. No, you're a lifesaver. Can I ask your name? <laughs> it's Kiryu. Eh, <laughs> Kiryu-san, huh? Here, take this as my thanks. You got an Enokitake. If you don't have any space, guess I'll send it to the item box. So you really do say regular mushrooms, huh? <sighs> That's what I said from the beginning. My mushrooms are guaranteed to put a smile on your face. Mm. That's exactly the kind of talk that confuses people. Look, you know there are mushrooms that make you hallucinate when you eat them. You don't really hallucinate by them, by the way. If you want to hallucinate, stay up for around 48 hours. Then you'll see hallucinations. You see patterns on the mushrooms uh, that he's talking about. And walls are looking like they're breathing. Plus, you get a pretty good reality check at the same time. So, uh, don't recommend them. If you sell mushrooms in a shady part of town like Camarusho, people are bound to get mixed up. Why don't you sell them somewhere else? Hmm, it's just... What, is there some reason it has to be Camarusho? I want as many as po people as possible to enjoy my mushrooms. Tokyo is the best place to find lots of people. Camarusho especially. Well, you're not wrong about that. I'm only just started out. If I pack up and leave now, it feel like I failed. I want to give it a bit more time. Mm. I see. Well, I won't stop you. Be careful <laughs> though. Eh, you're a kind man, Kiri-san. Thanks. They call me Kitajima the Shroomer. Why do you have the word Shroomer? It doesn't help you. For magnificent mushrooms. Kitajima's your man. See you around then. Friendship with the mushroom dealer. You got to know the mushroom dealer. Interacting with him will gradually fill the friendship gorge. You can check the status of his gorge at any time of the completion list. Fill your friendship with the mushroom dealer and see what happens. Ooh. Oh, curious, I got some great mushroom stock. Want some? <sighs> oh, that's too bad. Maybe another time. So I got what I was looking for, a fight. Now I can afford to do the actual fight I was looking for. Uh. Okay, I will, okay. I'll have on to the 10,000. It was only 10,000, it was about 100,000. I thought it was 800,000. Listen up, everybody, it's Punch Out Artist time. Today, my apprentice, Kirisan, will be taking all our comers. It's 10,000 a shot. You knock him down even once in 60 seconds, and you double your money. Yeah, give me a shot of this. Thought you never asked. First, the entropy. <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy presenting you the guy work. I can't stand. I'll get to blow some steam and make a buck. You certainly will. Hi. Okay, good luck. Take a look at the rules. Pay Kamoji an amount equal to the entropy in advance. The time limit is 6 seconds. If you get knocked down or knocked out, knocked out, you lose. If you hit the challenge, you also lose. Mm -hmm. Wait for 60 seconds. Yeah. 
He's not gonna get a single hit then. It's more likely to hit the, you know, the, the, the people watching around. Yeah, he almost hit that girl now. Come on, come on, drunky. I thought the dodge, you know, cost the uh, point, uh, the, the meter, the heat meter, didn't. <laughs> that was easy. But, you know, I really looked for a fight, not a fucking evade show. Ah, I can't land a blow. You're pretty good at dodging. Still, the exercise did me good, thanks. Good fight. Too bad luck wasn't on your side. Come on back and try again. Fine work, Kiryu-san. You were slippery as an eel. The challenge seems satisfied uh. too. Yeah, it turned out alright, but winning is a pretty thankless job in this case though. One thing you can try is evading at the last possible moment. Pulling that off is a great mm. feeling. Dodging at the last minute, huh? You learned shallow spirit. Press A in time with enemy attacks to build up the heat guard. That's good advice, Kamoji. Much appreciated. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Let's do this again sometimes. How about the winnings? We'll split the 10,000 entry fee, and I'll give you back your stake, so that's... 15,000 yen for you. Mm. We split the winnings. Consider it over it overhead the unlessened fees. Pretty fair if you ask me. Next up is 100,000. I'll be waiting. Mm. <sighs> yeah. Okay, we can't do it just yet. Another million yen vending machine though. We've seen two of them now. What's this? Oh. Let's see if we can pick a fight inside of here. Hello, boys. I'm ready to pick a fight with you. You know what? That's gonna be fun. He's back to 50 times, nice. Oh, okay, I need to get this heat stroke thing. Heat energy op uh, filled up. Okay, we have another. Um, Another alley. Oops, accidentally touched my my microphone. Volume control. So we have a part of who again. Is that a fucking syringe? Ow! Right in the leg too. No, I missed it. God damn it. And he was knocked out in two hits, really. I'm sorry, what happened again? Okay. Toughness light. Anything else here? Or. Yeah, another vending machine, a 10,000 one. Let's. Insert. Oh, special bait, okay. Let's just put it in the item box. Oh, more fights, okay. Yeah, I'm ready for a fight. It's just you? I thought it was all four of you, to be honest. Come on, big boy. Oh, <laughs> he's dead. There's no chance he survived that one. <laughs> Man, I'm so powerful now that they die very easily. Let's actually walk in this way, though. 
us. We'll take the opportunity to save the game. I haven't saved the game in a while after all. Let's save the game before we fight these guys. Okay, I'm ready to fight you street hooligans. Oh, you as regular hooligans? Okay. Or with street hooligans. You know, the much harder kind. Okay. You know what? Eat some fist to the face, bitch! Oh, seriously? That's how we're gonna play? You know what? I wanted to use the blue bike, but you get the green bike! Should've gone with the blue bike, would've hurt less. Go inside and buy some food, why don't we? And excellent touch. <laughs> Tango cooking. <laughs> hey, say. hey, welcome. Let's bet by the uh, ramen down here. The most expensive one. Thank <laughs> Then we left the shop. Then we left the shop. We left the shop. We left, left the uh, shop. Okay, that's the shogi parlor. I don't want to do that. Do we have any new areas? Remember the pocket circuits place. Okay, let's head for a shrine and upgrade Ooh. a little bit. Ooh. I just knocked him down, nice. So apparently we can find Mr. Shake down somewhere. Well, randomly on the street. Throw money off, uh, yeah. Do I have... I do have 8 points. Novo Rich Influx. Rich men started paying around town. Let's get that. So, let's see if we can go and fight against some t uh, rich guys while we look for more info. Sorry, lady. Hmm, some kind of convenience store. Not sure where the rich boys will appear, though. Oh. Just showed up in town. Well, we have some people running over there. Very suspicious. Okay, now they're just pushovers. That's some very poor quality on the sound there. There was a uh, chainsaw at first. Wait, there was a store that uh, switched uh, location. Popo Show was free. Okay, let's go down there. Must be the one that switched location. 
Tube can talk with you, that guy, though. We can talk with these guys. Mm. There's a little kill standing in line. That's line four. Could be something serious. I should ask around. Hello, hey. kid. Uh -huh. Oh, yes. What's going on? Why are all these people here? Um, um did you want one too? I'm really sorry, but they said I'll get the last one in stock. Mm. What are you talking about? Huh? Aren't you lining up for Aura Q3? Aura Q3? Is that some kind of secret code? No, it's Aura Q3. The newest game in the Arakura series. Arakura 3 is short for Arakura 3 Quest of, for the Quantum Quill. I can't wait to read the instruction manual on the way home. Mm. Hmm, never heard of it. So people are actually lining up to buy a video game. What an amazing world we live in. Huh. Yeah, it's the most popular game in Japan right now. I went looking for it with Papa, but they were sold out everywhere. But then my friend told me this place was getting a new batch today, so I grabbed my allowance and ran all the way here. I made it just in time and got the last reservation ticket. I'm so happy it's gonna be the best game ever made. Times are strange if it's hard to buy a toy. Sorry to bug you, kid. Thanks for the info. Yep, bye, mister. Let's not go from work for this. If my manager finds out before I get back, I'm so dead. No cutting in line, pal. You have to pay by the rule. Play by the rules and get back in line like everyone else. I'm so glad I lined up first thing in the morning. I'm going to be the first to get it. Oh, it's Don Quixote. Okay. Now watch me go and buy the game. Health potions, comfy souls. Gentleman's umbrella, we can buy that now. I can afford that. We couldn't buy the game, that's unfortunate. I would have given it to the kid, to be honest, but... Uh, <laughs> kind of funny, you know. Getting him disappointed at first. Okay, something is up here. Hmm, isn't that... Oh, it is the Yakuza <laughs> guy. No, it's a slime high school. Huh. Game over, Lewis, sir! Hey, you're the kid who lined up for that game, right? Did you manage to get it? Oh, m mister. What's the matter? Something wrong? Yes. Oh, my brand new video game. That guy stole it. Daddy. What? Wait, you mean the high school kid who last left? Uh-huh. He just ran up and yelled at me to hand it over. He took it. My Aura Q3. I spent all morning waiting in line too. I, I saved up all my allowance for a really, really long time to get it. And now it's gone. <laughs> Stealing from a little boy. That's really Good. low. Hey kid, what's your name? It's... It's Akio. Akio. Got it. Hang tight, Akio. I'll get your game back. Huh? You will? So, there's no need to cry. M mister, okay. I won't cry anymore. <laughs> Good. That's showing some spine, little man. I like that. Leave it to me. Yay. Thank you, mister. That high school delinquent ran off towards Pink Street with Ar Arceus Arakura game. Oh, there he is. Ooh, a vending machine, though. Hmm, isn't that? <laughs> Gang Goomba. Later, freak! <sighs> no fair, I've been defeated. No doubt about it. That's the kid who took Arcus game. Hey, you. You have that Arakura game, don't you? I think he just got it stolen, to be honest. Uh? What's it to you? My adventure just came to an abrupt end, so leave me alone. Yeah. No can do. I'll take back the Arakura, Arakura you took from Akio. RQ3? That's the last thing I want to hear about right now. Forget it, I'm gonna grind your ass just for the experience. Menacing man. What's so He's a teenager, what's so menacing about him? Oh no, hold my ear, he's so intimidating. Oh no! It's not like I take this sign and then just ram it onto his face. Like the little bitch he is. Oh no! 
So menacing. Uh. Me, mister. <laughs> okay, I just caught the guy who took your Arakure. Oh, yay. Okay, give Ar Arakure his Arakure back. The Goomba guy stole it now. Look, man, I don't have it. Give it up already. If you don't want another beating, hand it over and get a job next time you want a video game. I told you, I don't have it. I got robbed by a better thief than me. Daddy. What? You were robbed too? Yeah, the jerk from a street gang busted out his dagger of stealing and made me give it to him. Mm. A gang member? You mean that guy who was here? <sighs> yeah, lame. I could go home leveling up, but now my RQ3 is probably going to some dude who's not even a fan. Uh? Excuse me, your era Q3? That era Q3 wasn't yours. You rob a little kill then turn around and cry like a baby when you get mugged? How pathetic is that? If you haven't learned your lesson yet, you want another class? Ah, no! I'm already out of life! So sorry man, I'm out of here! My aura Q3. Don't worry, Arco. I'll get it back for you, I promised. Mister. Okay, got it. So the kid who stole Arceus aura Q3 had it stolen by some thug. And that guy went off towards Taihei Boulevard East. Yeah, but I have this to buy it from first. Why well, the kid has a deep voice? I don't know, he was born that way, Cloud? Ooh, Mandarin Orange. Not bad. I see you and okay, just follow this area. Okay, we're going to link with fights first. Really? Come on, our game. Or not the game, we're gonna die. There we go. Not a lot of cash, but some cash. All right, Cloud. Hmm. Isn't that? Huh? Later, loot. <sighs> Damn it! So the Yakuza member stole it from him, no doubt. I thought we took Arakuni from the kid who stole the game from Akio. Oh. Hey, you're the guy who stole Arakure from the kid who stole it from Akio, aren't you? Huh? Who does Akio? And so what if I did? I stole my chance and I took it! That was Akio then? Yeah. No, you robbed the kid who robbed Akio of his Arakure. Ah. I don't get it! Forget it, just give back the Arakure cartridge you stole. Arakure 3! Arakure 3! I don't wanna hear another word about Arakure 3! I'm gonna stomp your flat, Pops! Street dog. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> He's dead. Like a Goomba? Mister. <laughs> hey Akio, I just caught the wannabe punk who stole your RQ3 from the nerdy high school kid. Uh, okay. I don't get it, but that's great. Alright, give Akio his Arakure. Sorry pal, but your game got pinched! I'm not playing around. Give the kid his game or we can suffer some more. I'm still yet. It's really gone! Some a-hole got to jump on me! Daddy. What? You were robbed too? Uh... Oh yeah! This hardest Yakuza time, held me at gunpoint, forced me to give it to him, then took off. Mm. Yakuza type? You mean the guy who was just there? <sighs> uh huh, what shit day I'm having? Then Yakuza guy jacked my Ara Q3, it's probably not even a fan. Uh. Your Ara Q3? The game wasn't yours to begin with. Why? <laughs> you steal from a kid, then cry like a little baby when you get mugged. I'm seeing a pathetic pattern here. Is this getting through to you? How about we go another round? 
Myora Q3. Oh, Myora Q3. <laughs> Don't worry, Akio. I promise I'll hunt down for you. Mm. Mister, okay, got it. So the thug who took Akio's Ara Q3 from the kid who stole it in the first place ended up having it taken by some hardest Yakuza who went off towards Tahei Boulevard. My head hurts. Imagine the why Goose chase a little kid. It's a good one. Oh, I'm gonna go and save this guy first. So many distraction points. So, we have a bunch of uh, link points again. Oh. You were the one that was getting knocked out or lying around. I'm sorry, please don't hit me anymore. Tarina, okay. So let's go and beat up the Yakuza punk then. Ooh, another vending machine. <laughs> You're finally mine, Ara Q3. My quest is complete. Hey, that game you got there. Oh. What's that, fool? You're one of the losers who couldn't score an Ara Q3. That's some tough luck. <laughs> For you see, this Ara Q3 belongs to us. <laughs> so if you want to live, get off my street. And listen. Don't bother looking for a place that's still selling our Q3. Just find a fool who bought one and take it. <sighs> Villains. Every last one. What's this world coming to? Uh? Well, what do you say, boy? That our Kure. I'm taking it back. What's that? Take it back? Don't act like it was your game to start with. <laughs> uh? Shut up, it's complicated. Oh, I see. You're an RQ3 Hunter 2 then. Playtime is over. I'm not holding back either. Welcome to your doom. Jakusa. That's gonna hurt you. Hello. Oh shit, he shot me, the bastard. Okay, I... I'm gonna die if I get shot again. Oh, thank you, Henny and Lean, for the uh, 100 bits. I appreciate it. If I pronounce that right. Oh, this cannot be! I'll be taking the arrow cursor with me. Oh, hold on! I need that! Give it back, come on! Give it back! This was never yours to begin with! Fella, I'm begging you, please. My little boy's really been looking forward to playing it. Your son? Uh, yeah, my old lady left me and took the boy with her. He's been wanting Arrow Q3 ever since he read about it. Is his son the kid who bought it? That had it stolen? We weren't looking everywhere, but there ain't none for sale anywhere. I just wanted my boy to be happy. Fella, I'm begging you. You gotta let me have it, please. I get the picture now. Sorry, but I can't do that. You probably don't know this, but a little kid stayed out his allowance and went through a lot of trouble to buy the last copy of it, this Arakure 3. Yeah. No? I didn't stick up to no little kid. I took it off some worth of good. Uh. That's right. You got the game from a punk, but that game belonged to a little kid first. Long story short, you took RQ3 from a wannabe punk who took it from a high school bully who took it from the last boy in line who bought it in the first place. Mm. My head hurts just thinking about it, but alright. So that's what happened. 
And I came to get it back for a little kid. It's going back to rifle owner. I'm sorry. Fella, I'm the fool here. Give it back to the kid for me. Damn, I was about to make someone else's kid cry for the sake of my own. What kind of monster have I become? I thought I could make my boy happy with something I stole from someone else. I was wrong. How was I supposed to be a good dad to my boy? To Akio like this, I figured. Same kid. I guess you better think about that. Wait, what? Akio? Oh, hi, mister. <laughs> Perfect timing, Akio. Just got your RQ3 back. Oh, really? Yippee. Mm -hmm. Huh? Akio? Is that you? My Akio? Oh, hi, Papa. Nani? P Papa? <clears throat> you guys are related? That's right. Are you friends with Papa, mister? Mm. Uh, yeah, you might say that. Sure. Mm. Wait, buddy. The little kid you were telling me about. That's our Q3 that was what Arco bought with his own money. And I tried to. That seems to be how this is shaking out. But why, Arco? Why didn't you say something to your papa? All she had to do was ask. I could have given you the money to buy our Q3 anytime. B because Mama would get mad at you, papa. For spending money on golfing and go-karts and board games and... I didn't want Mama to get so mad at you even more for spending all your money again, Papa. So I tried to buy it by myself. Uh, Akio! Mister, Papa looks kind of scary, but he's a really, really nice man once you get to know him. He took me to a bunch of game stores just the other day. Papa's not living with Mama and me now. I think he's lonely, so please stay friends with him, okay? Actually, Akko, your papa helped me get your RQ3 back. Really? Thank you, papa. I did, in a way. <laughs> Akio, I don't want to see you crying again. Be careful going home with your game. <clears throat> yup, got it. Thank you, mister. Mister, thanks. This is to apologize, or to thank you for teaching this fool a lesson, maybe. Whatever. I want you to have it. You got a sunburst. From now on, be a good dad at all the time, not just in front of Akio. You don't want to do anything that'll make kids sad, no matter whose kids they are. Yep, yeah, you got that right. Papa, this is too hard for me by myself. Let's go to Mama's house and play our Q3 together. I need help with the maps. Oh. Oh, sure. With my expert advice, we'll be making a beeline to that nasty demon lord in no time. <laughs> now that's how a game should be played. Our Akure quest has been defeated. Now well, let's uh, spend 10,000 at the vending machine. Let's got some firecrackers. That's neat. Let's see, where could I... Up there, okay. That's the store I'm supposed to go to, the Kamashuru store. Hopefully I'll run into some rich boys. Oh, more Jakusa, okay. okay. Why can't I do these special? So weird. Oh, I didn't have enough points for it. For it. Okay. <laughs> this gonna hurt. Okay, that wasn't a uh, closed fist. Though it was an open fist. Okay, no, that's not the right area. Sound again. Yakuza are rich boys. Or Yakuza, okay. That's fine though. The Yakuza gave me a lot of cash for the game, so not too bad. Oh, that's 4 million now, and you notice. 
Yeah, she can't believe that. You know what I'm gonna do with my money? I'm gonna spend them on abilities. Let's increase my max health a bit. And let's upgrade the heat retention. So my heat and this uh, brawler stance lasts a bit longer. Still no witch guys yet though. We have to, we do have some more men in black here though. I ran into every single one before the fight was you know initiated. That's kind of funny. Oh, <laughs> this is gonna hurt so bad for you. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna run around in a circle and then jump at you like that. Side we go. Get some of that. Maybe, yes, maybe. Couldn't go here after all. Let's buy a sushi. A sushi. Sushi set. Is there anyone I can talk with inside of here, or nope? Apparently not. Now we can look at stuff. That's uh... Shonen King I know is... Is uh... <laughs> what's in? Is um... Anime. Or manga I mean. Oh that's a nice cover. A magazine about games of all sorts of... Or a magazine about games for all sort of hardware. It's full of information about upcoming games and top developers, as well as popular columns, previews, and video game reviews. We're not gonna look at the magazines anymore. We're gonna leave this area now. Okay, so that was not the right store then. Let's head for um, one of the taxis. Is this a guy I can fight, I wonder? Yep, men in black, okay. Oh, he's back up, plus pretty don't fire. That's gonna hurt. Oh, yeah, that must hurt. You know what? You're gonna get the same treatment. <laughs> I really like, you know, these takedown moves. They're pretty brutal, and I really enjoy that. So, let's see if I can take the cab if I have enough information or not. No, okay. We'll just run there then. In hopes of, uh, you know, getting more information. Yikes! Oi. Hey, you alright? Uh? Eh? Figures of Ruby Bomb is on Swaggering Punk. Oi, oi! You are an. Oh man! This isn't going to end well. Are you alright? Uh, no, what's the big idea, yo? I'm sorry, uh, what were your step shit from brains? You're not hurt or anything, are you, asshole? Alright, if that's how we want this to play out. What? Yeah, I'm so sorry, no! I mean, I'm in a rush, see? So, please get lost, you punk ass, so and so. 
It stresses like a delinquent, but uh, it doesn't have the tough guy act. Damn junkie, another sub story. Oh, that's a bowling alley. What's going on? This is a rough looking crowd. <laughs> Oi! I'm so freaking stoked, man! A rest ritual, buddy! You're gonna march the silvers! Ah. Too right! Those guys are rock and roll gods! Look at this bitching crowd! They drew all these punks without any ads or nothing! Crazy key on the Yokomachi silver fucking rule! And keep your pants on! But how do you. Your Kamicha Silver's gonna hold a Q&A panel too! Yeah. No fucking way! They're famous for never saying a word and letting their music do the talking! I wonder what the hell they talk about! Sounds like some bands doing an event here. Must be popular with the local punks. Hmm? Is that... That is... Yep. Hello there, kid. <sighs> Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, look at these people! Holy cow, what are we gonna do? Oi. Hey, you. Hey, yikes! <laughs> Gee whiz, pal, I need to beat my arm. What are you doing, chopping around behind me, you ugly knob? Uh, yeah, sorry. I thought I should apologize for bumping into you earlier. Oi! Who? Oh, you're that, you're that man. No, I should be apologizing for my own careless. I mean, whatever, piss off! Uh, um, sure. Hardcore fool again, really? This guy? Oh? Wait a second. Could you possibly be aware, unaware of who I am? Yeah. Mm. Are you asking if we met before we bumped into each other? If we did, I don't recognize yeah. you. Oh, wait a second then. So you really don't know who I am? Willikers, what a relief. Hmm? I'm sorry. I was rude not to introduce myself. Name's Kyo, but my stage name is Crazy Kyo. I'm the vocalist in a band. Let me guess. The Yokomichi Silvers. The same band those young punks there are excited to see. Aren't you guys some kind of legendary Yankee band? Yes, that's us! We're doing a street show right here later! Oh, sorry to bug you before your show. Good luck. Whoa! Where the hell do you think you're going, old man? Uh, uh wait, please, sir! Did it don't go? Hmm? Hmm? Maybe, maybe you can save me! Save you? Nani. What? Are you even hardcore in the slightest? No, he's not. Clearly, you can see it on him. No, but it's a joke. We tried dressing all punk in the show. To our shock, we got pretty po popular with the Yank crowd. But now we have to keep up the charade full time. Uh, thanks for the uh, other set of uh, 100 uh, bits. Henny and Leon. But now we have to keep it. Oh, yeah, full time. Over time, we gained a fan base for enemy punks, and the Yokomichi Silvers became heroes to the rebellious youth of Japan. That whole style is called Janky now. Mm. Huh, there's more running a band than I thought. So, what did you mean by me saving you? I, uh, actually, I wanted to teach me how to be a hardcore hooligan. Daddy. Teach you to be a Janky? Yes, you see. For today's event, we also have to do a live panel, a meet and greet for the fans. For every member of the Yokomichi Silvers, myself included, a law-abiding chore boy. We've never even shoplifted. If we were to talk in front of real Yank, they realize that we're phonies. Fake punks. Oh, wrong voice. <laughs> Fake punks, eh? Now that you mention it, the way you talk doesn't match how you dress at all. Right, so if we spoke to our fans, we'd lose all our credibility and popularity in an instant. Or worse, what if they want revenge on us for fooling them? Uh, thanks for the five... Uh, Henny Swedish and Lee donated, donated five Swedish Krona. Krona. Imagine, Imagine playing, playing a single, single, single video, video, game. video game. Have a good, Have day. A good day. Yeah, imagine playing a single video game. <laughs> Thanks for the five Swedish crowns. I don't want to do the either, but now our agency says we need to hone our speaking skills if we want to stay popular. 
They're making us do this! We've been avoiding every situation where we might have to talk instead of just performing. But now... Got it. So you want me to teach you how to behave like a Yankee so you can talk like one. But why me? Why? Well, that would be because you're my ideal of what a hooligan should be. That confident demeanor. Your race is short clear. The bar of your attitude that says, don't touch me. Touch me and get cut. And yet, you also excuse a sense of kindness. A guy who extends a helping hand to the weak. A hooligan with a heart of gold. That's my ideal Yankee. Well, yeah. I'm a Yakuza, kind of. You can teach us we don't blow our cover. More than that, I think you can give us a Yankee wisdom that will propel the Yokomichi Silvers to a new heights of hooliganism. Please, if we lose the chance, the Yokomichi Silvers may have to break up. Please teach me how to carry myself like a true Yankee. Alright, we'll do it. Okay then. I'm not sure how useful I can be, but I'll try. Really? Thank you so very much! Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't catch your name. It's Kiryu. Okie dokie, kuryu son. Give me a second, please. I'll go get the others. So to keep you waiting, kuryu son. <laughs> I look like a bunch of nerds. These are drummer, Sleazy Tarashi. Hi. Hey there, I'm Tarashi. My stage name is Sleazy, but I have no experience with the ladies. Never have even seen a boob. <laughs> okay. Good for you, I guess. This is our basis, Bad Boy Aku. I'm Aku. Hope he's kind, friend. And this is Kenyusa. Who is going to impact the ways of, of true Yankee side hooliganism onto us? Please teach us, Kurosan! Hmm, oh, wrong voice. Hmm, you guys are so polite and proper. I'm starting to wonder if there's anything I can do for you. Oh no, please don't say that. We're all pretty good guys at heart, so please help us. In your case, being pretty good guys is the problem. But I did agree to this, so somehow we have to turn you guys into hard-edged punks. <laughs> oh yes, please! Hmm, how can I show you guys how to be tougher though? Hmm. Hmm, well, maybe you could come up with an opening remark for little me! Your opening remark? Yes, I want to kill off our panel with authority. Being hooligans, we should come across. We shouldn't come across as weak or hesitant. No, you shouldn't. But uh, that's what you do. Please, Kirsan, I need a singer of an opening line to set the tone. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today. <laughs> Hello, but in English. Do that. Hello, but in English. How about opening with hello, but in English? In English? Do you really think so? I mean, I'm only gonna speak English. Is that in Yankee style? Yeah. I think it would be just right for a Yankee. Young rebels fall hard for what's cool, and English is the language of rock and roll. That's a point there, to be honest. Think about it. Their hero, the vocalist of the Yokomichi Silvers, speak a language they don't know. They can't help but impress, but be impressed by his worldliness. But do you have to keep speaking English afterwards? That's going to be a challenge. I only know a few greetings. Uh. The same goes for them, though. If you sound like you know what you're saying, you can get a get. You can get away with it. I see. I'm not quite convinced, but I'll give it my best. Rock and roll. 
Ooh, ooh, Kiryu-san, question. Hmm, what is it? Well, the agency told me to tell the fans about how I spend my days off, when I'm not rehearsing or performing. Mm. Your days off, huh? Makes sense that fans would want to know their heroes lived from day to day. Tarashi, how would you spend a day off? Well, I make a habit for getting up bright and early so I can make some pancakes. After breakfast, I take my darling puppy Chibi-chan to the park for a mid-morning stroll. And then, we have lunch at the chic cafe to rest our feet. On our way home, we do a little window shopping. After that, I binge on the dramas I got my VCR until it's bedtime. Uh. <laughs> you just described a typical girl's day. <laughs> what? Uh, sorry, that's really made you sound like a fashionable young woman. I was so surprised they got in I, I got intense. <laughs> or, oh, um, uh, uh, so scared. <laughs> oh no, Kiri san, you shouldn't shout like that. You made Sleazy Tarashi cry. That's a bit much, don't you think? <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> She's say sorry. Uh. Uh, yeah, my bad, Tarish, Tarashi. It's, it's alright. I'm your stall. I was expecting it. It's all. <laughs> so, so, how about I would spend a day off? Uh, yeah, right. One thing's clear. You can tell the fans how you really spend your free time. No, I guess not, but then what should I say? Oh. No, I guess not, but then what should I say? What would I be doing instead? <laughs> Rescuing puppies. <laughs> Fighting all day. On your days off, you spend your time fighting from dawn to dusk. Fight! Fighting? I don't really get it. But who do hooligans fight? Do Yankee have sworn enemies or something? It's not about having enemies. Yankees are always ready. And willing to fight. If two punks lock eyes, a fight is on. That's how it's on the mean streets of Kam Kamurucho. And just so you know, fist fights are considered the most hard work and cool. Jeepers, what a brutal community! I can't take my dog out for a walk in that war zone. Yeah. Hold on, the dogs that punks keeps tend to be fiercely loyal and thirsty for blood. They're often trusty partners in a street fight. Is that right? I can't picture my delicate chibi Sean engaging in a kerfuffle like that. <laughs> Boy, am I glad we could hit you up for advice, Kiryu-san. You're the perfect hooligan role model. Kiryu-san? Hmm? Oh, you're a bad boy Aku, right? What's the matter? What will I say? Hmm, Aku, you didn't get a topic like Tarashi. Oh. They just told him to wing it. Oh. They just told him to wing it. He's free to talk about whatever, even though he's practically mute. Bad boy Arco even has a backstory, locked up in a juvenile with former tears from birth. 
Bad Marker crushes packs of pints before you even finish Prescott's. Hmm. hmm. Uranus is trying to fit a square peg in a round hole. Argus a man of few words with a crazy backstory. What should we talk about to make him sound hardcore? The time he crushed again. God damn it, he should have stayed silent, honestly. Would have been better. Talk about the time you crushed the gang. Curious that! That's only bad about Arkham fictional backstory! He's never actually fought anyone in his entire life! I know that, but it's a perfect topic for giving you a hardcore vibe. I also think Argus' delivery will make his story sound even more genuine. Mm. That's true, if you were a smooth talker, the whole story might sound rehearsed and inauthentic. Can't do it? Don't worry, I'll think of the basic story. First, Argus has a friend, a cute girl he knows since they were kids. That childhood friend is key in any jank story. Childhood friend? Cute? Uh. Right, so when you were three years old, Aku. How does that grab you? Wow, that's smoking, Kimmy san! You're a genius for real! Aku, you're good with that, right? Solid. Eh, yeah, I'll give you guys advice on what to say too. Yes, please! Yes, please! Yeah, please! Yokomochi Silver, we're almost ready for you. Uh? Oh, it's a time! Uh, I mean... I mean... Uh, run! Oh, so sorry! Uh, I mean, you can come on when you're ready! I'll be watching from the audience. Yes, please watch us! We're going to hit this hardcore Yankee thing out of the park! <laughs> we're gonna kick out some stuff. Mm-hmm. Here they are. Put your hands together for the Yukomichi Silvers. Woo! Crazy Kyo-san! Bad boy Aku over here! Whoa! Check out Crazy Kyo-san's original ESP guitar! Small red style! The man's got the janky look nailed! Wow, they are popular. When they're not talking, they do look like real ga greasers. Something much high rock and roll after school! Toroshi! Aku! Hit it, boys! That concludes today's performance by Amy Yokomochi Silvers. Just listen to his songs, I can see why Yankee kids across Japan look up Crazy Q's band. Now we would like to move on to a special meet and greet panel discussion with the band members. Whoa, no way! Crazy Q's sons actually gonna talk to us? That's totally mental! I can't fucking wait to hear Bad Boy's Arcus voice! Here's where it gets real. They better pull this off. Uh? Yo, Grease House! Hello everyone! Rock and roll! We are Yokomichi Silvers! Holy shit! Crazy Kurosan can even speak English! That's so bitchin! I'm gonna go totally mental! My god! That totally authentic pronunciation! It drives me wild! I'm shooting bricks here! I'm fine, thank you! And you? Yeah! Yes, the audience loves it. Using English was a good choice. Awesome, thank you, Crazy q -san. Next, we should like to hear some Sleazy Taroshi san and Bad Boy Aku san as well. First up, Sleazy Taroshi san. Here's a question we got from a fan. How do you usually spend your days off? Bruh, me? 
If I get a day off, I spend it fighting mostly. Sleeps ferocious as a beast, man! Forrest likes exercise to him! Too wicked for words! No oh shit, I would pay to get my ass kicked by Tarosha-san, even just once. Yes, you know, if it, if I don't allow a, nothing by going bare knuckle in a brawl, it ain't a fist, it ain't a fight. Yeah! Good, the fans are eating it up. I know spending all day fighting would rev up these punks. Certainly would. Thank you, Sleepsy Taroshi san. To close, it out, to close it out, it's time for Bad Boy Arku san to say a few words. I smash gangs! Wicked! Bad Boy Arku san's letting us in his brutal past, right here in the freaking public! Holy shit, what's a beast? I'm cry crying, man! My birthday, three years old. <laughs> what a bunch of posters. <laughs> I rescued Nonshan, my childhood friend. Wrecked eight gangs to save her, on top of tower, shirtless. Yeah, bad boy Aku, cool in ways I can't explain or understand. Good, the fans bought it. There's nothing better than a good war story to gain street cred. Yeah, I saw everything. Good work. Kiryu-san, we tried to apply what we learned from you about the ways of the Yankee to our panel. <laughs> the fan response was fabulous. I'm still in shock. Yeah. yeah, it seems that way. You guys learned well. I'm proud of you all. It looks like the Yokomachi Silms will keep shooting up towards stardom at the speed of light. We owe you big time, Kiryu-san. Oh, I've got a wild shirt. Nice. Oh, that was most fun I ever had speaking in public. Kiryu-san, thanks. From now on, we're going to keep working hard to expand on what you taught us about the way of the Yankee. We'll work on our speaking skills as well. Keep an eye on us, Kiryu-san. The Yokomochi Silvers are kinging up on our gear. Uh. Yeah, give it your best shot. People sure have all kinds of challenge to face. At least those guys are diligent. They should survive the rough road from the entertainment world somehow. Don't give up, Yokomuchi Silvers. Okay, complete five Kiryu sub stories. Land in theater alley is the one we're going to supposed to go to.
Yeah, see ya, Cloud. I think I'm gonna end streaming soon. Might continue a little bit further, I don't know. Just gonna answer a message real quick. Blending theater alley across the Mac Bowl. Aren't we f near that Mac Bowl? Oh. I see blend. Here's the Mac Bowl, so it should be around here somewhere. Then we know our destination. Oh, we have a fight, alright. I'll fight. I love me some fighting. Oh, as I guess Yakuza too, nice. Okay, we have one knockdown. You're going to go down now. Who's that guy? Well, she does have a badass shirt at the very least. Shut your whole fat ass and open your wallet! <laughs> okay, that's, that's a bit extreme. Whoa, what? Uh -huh. I'm telling you, I can't pay. I'm dead broke right now. Don't give me that bullshit, Tabs. I watched your sorry ass come out from the... Out of that soap land last night. What? Yeah. Yeah, then you march your little buddies around from club to club, drink till dawn. Living pretty large for a broke guy, ain't you? You were spying on me? You're goddamn right. You know how many different lenders you're dicked over, pork shop? I collect it's collection day and your ass is getting beat. A female collection agent? Pretty unusual. Sounds like a real ball buster too. <laughs> Uh, she's terrifying as ever! Bacchus? What? She's a friend of yours? So does. You got that right! Sure wouldn't make an enemy of her! That's their uh, Miss Tatsu, the debt collector! She's a legend in Yokohama! Mm. But yeah, see ya Cloud. Thanks for stopping by, hope you enjoyed. Miss Tatsu, huh? She takes on the job and makes other collection boys run away crying, and she always, always gets the cash. Her style's bold, blunt, and brutal. Yeah, a lot of people can't handle bold, blunt, uh, blunt and brutal people. Most people can't handle bold people. Most ha people can't handle blunt people. So why would they be able, even be able to handle uh, brutal people? And that 
touch my bulldog's own ten tenacity, and you get one mean bite, my boy. Mm. You seem awfully familiar with her methods. That's the voice of personal experience. <laughs> ah, you got me, boy. I was this close to getting my face caved in over a silly little duct a while back. Why am I not surprised? Hey, look hey. there, boy. We're about to see what makes our lady, Miss Tatsu, so incredible. Huh, you think you get the money out of me? I'd like to see you try. Ha, huh, your boys and your tiny toys. You think your little butter knife there is gonna stop me? Mm. Group the tough fact, silly tits. I put a dozen dudes in the hospital with this baby. That's a very small knife. Looks like a fucking fruit knife. Jeez. If you have a tear stain in the pool, are you ready for me though? I'll hear you out. That's my line, sugar mobs. <laughs> Except the part about hearing you out, since you'll be too dead. Now make your move. Ugh, putting a weapon on a woman? That's going too far. I'm stopping this. No need, boy. Trust wait. Oh, just wait, not trust wait. Hmm? No blinking now, boy. Keep those eyes on Miss Tatsu. And showtime! We haven't had voice acting in quite a while. Oh, we're gonna learn a new fighting stance, I think. Ooh, I think he broke his arms. Yeah, by the looks of it, he bro she broke her arms. Yeah, his arms, I mean. And we get a new fighting stance. Awesome. Whoa, those moves. <laughs> hey, looks like that beat down gave you a few ideas. Uh, yeah, more than a few. Oh, yeah. Fantastic boy. Hope you're ready to put them into practice. Mm. What? Look at my yonders. Looks like our bad guys here's got some friends. Oh shit, Jinkun's getting beat to hell. He paid a tab last night, so what say we pay him back by sucker punching this crazy bitch for him? Hear that boy? Those steam bombs are planning on getting the drop on the little lady from behind! Uh, sounds that way. Lovely crowd. They're a perfect match for that sort of scum that pull a knife on a woman. Why don't you give him a little demo of what's a man supposed to be? And I'm saying this doesn't involve her this time. Yeah. I wouldn't. She can clearly defend herself. But there's a whole pack of them. I'm jumping in. Yes, yes that's my boy. Keeping children alive and working in a fine bit of training and process. Eh. The hell do you want? Oi. You guys playing sucker punch that woman in the back? You got an eavesdropping problem? And damn straight we are. You think I want a psycho bitch to see me coming? We'll drop her before she can get those claws out. I don't care how tough she is. You don't hit a woman. And needing a group to do is do it is just pathetic. You call yourselves men? Uh. The fuck did you say? You got a big mouth and a death wish, pal. Yo, we're dropping this guy before we take care of the broad. Ah, yeah, good luck with that. That's a bunch of goons. Switch to B style. You can switch to B style by pressing yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Press X while near a large weapon showing uh, the blue arrow mark to automatically pick it up and swing it. This is called an auto weapon attack. Bash an enemy with an auto weapon attack. I don't even know where. Oh, here we go. Okay, I need to use two more items then. See, 
Seems like this is only good when with an enemy attacks when you're near a big group of enemies and with items around. Withstand the enemy attacks. When using B style, holding LB to guard lets you withstand enemy attacks with a resist guard. You will take a certain amount of damage, but you are protected against attacks coming from any direction. Bolstering your defense by equipping gear in the pause menu further reduce the damage you take with resist guard. Be sure to equip any gear you find. So LB okay. Okay, well. How do I drop this then? Oh, there we go. Come on now. I have two more times, one more time, thank you. Use beast stunt moves to pulverize the packs of towers. I don't really like how slow it is now. But yeah, it's definitely good for crowd control. <laughs> wow, a double knockout. Nice. Are we gonna go for another double knockout? Nope. We got... I'm sure that guy's pretty much dead though. Here we go, all defeated, nice. Eh? Uh, what is this guy? All those beating on him and it's like he doesn't even feel it. Eh? You want some more? Uh, I'm not leaving till at least punch that uppity bitch out. Well, well. If it isn't Porky's little friends, I saw you boys crawling the bars last night. Ah! But I must be hearing things because it sounded like you said something about punishing a bitch out. If you're interested, this bitch is ready to go. N no ma'am, that's just crazy. What kind of man would punch a lady? And w with a group? So pathetic. <laughs> right. Now pick up the sad sack lying over there and get the hell out of my sight. I got what I came for. Got no use for him now. Yes ma'am. Marcus, been a while. Yeah. Same old Miss Tatsu, strong as a bear on baroids. <laughs> baroids. You're one to talk, old man, so you introduce me to my knight in shining armor here. What? Oh, right. This here's my latest find, a real diamond in the rough. Name's Kiryu. <sighs> Kiryu, huh? I'll remember the name. If you got Bacchus signing your praise, you gotta be pretty tough. Yes. The boy seems a future champion. I stake my career on it. Ah, okay. Now I'm seeing what this is. You're thinking Kiryu here is your ticket to a fat stack of cha cash, cash, yeah, cash, which you'll then use to pay me back, so we get to stay friends. Easy, Tiger. I told you. It'd take a while, but you get it all back. Oh, and speaking of favors, why don't you train the boy in here? Wait, what? Do I seem like a patient, patient, teacher type to you? Sorry, no can do. No. No, don't be like that. We both need him to get stronger. Once he has a chef, we'll be rolling in dough. Besides, I know you're sickly the dotting type. He'll make champion a hell of a lot safer when you're beating him into shape. That means you get paid sooner, see? Win, win, win. Oi. Bacchus, what do you think you're doing here, man? <laughs> Negotiating an apprenticeship with Miss Tatsu for you, obviously. Trust me, you train under her. You'll be master of the ring in no time flat. Uh? You're insane. I'm in seriously hot water right now. I don't have time to humor your little fantasies. What? what? You're in hot water too, my boy. Are we talking knife in the ribs here? Cause I warned you about, you about that. I'll be lucky if that's all I get. And seriously, what's this obsession of with me getting stabbed about? Alright, chuckleheads. That's enough. Neither of one of you is making a damn bit of sense. But I hear where you're coming from, Bacchus. Ditch the championship talk, and just say you care about this Kiryu kid. If you're worried about him, own it. Look, you did me a solid a minute ago. I can do this. Besides, the old man is right that my training will make a real man out of you. Hope I care about the pier sometime. I got the training space there. You train at the pier? You got it. Can live there too. Pay me a visit sometime. See for yourself. I think you like the digs. Anyway. 
That was my last job in the city, so I'm headed back to the base. Here you, you, me, Pierre, training. I'll be waiting. Bakus, I've already got future planned. Got a future plan. I'm sorry, but I can't be your champion. What sport are we even talking about? Boxing? Not that it matters, I can't. Oh, I know that. Doesn't mean I'll stop trying. But I know where to stop making a nuisance of, nuisance of myself. I'll give you some space, champ. It's about time for my afternoon drink anyway. I've been clear my head. Good luck with that. Just don't have too many. Yeah. You think a guy called Bacchus can hold his wine? Ha! See you around, boy. Keep those rib knife free, okay? Get out. Get out of here. And get out of here. And thanks. I'll be careful. Didn't expect to get wrapped up in that mess. But at least I didn't come em at least I didn't come away empty-handed. Now back to looking for leads on Tachibana real estate. And this my friends is where I go and save the game. And and oh, god damn it. Hey there, buddy. Been looking for you. You again. You got a lot of nerve showing up. Now what do you want? I think it's pretty clear what I want. Time to pay your protection money, pal. If you're doing business in Kamurucho, you're doing business with us. To hell with that. It's not protection money if you don't show up to actually protect me when I need it. And you have to have the gall to ask for more? When you need it? What are you talking about? I'm talking about Tachibana real estate. When they came and chased me out, you people were nowhere in sight. Some protection. Tachibana? What? I will touch Tachibana real estate. Yeah, they Look, it's complicated. Complicated, my ass. You got scared and ran away. What could be simpler? Is it scared? Who do you think? Thanks to you, I had to relocate. Now I'm scrambling to get new customers to make up for all the ones I lost. I couldn't pay you even if I wanted to. I think you better keep the address in check, asshole. Mind if I cut in? Oh. Huh? What do you want? Who are you? What family are you with? I'm not in anybody's family. In Pipe Town, it's this guy I'm talking to. Excuse me? What do you want from me? You say you open shop here because Tachibana Real Estate forced you out from me of your last location, that's right? Oh, I see what this is. You're trying to be this guy's new muscle. Oh, hell no. What? Our family handled this cafe's protection for 30 years. You tried to swoop in on our turf, it will mean war. Looks like you need some convincing to stay quiet while I speak with the owner here. Shut your mouth and try me, I'll kill you! Okay, so we're gonna fight against this guy. Try out this uh, beast stance for sure. Ooh, I really love these kicks. That's so nice. Pick up the, the traffic cone here. Thank you, game. Oh, you have a certain set of hits with it. I get it. But there we go, we knocked him out with a sign. What the hell? I'm not losing some kid. You just did. Now get lost and don't show your face around this sky shop again. Damn it! This ain't over. There, now we can find a talking piece. So, so what? In the end, you're just taking his place as this guy squeezing me for protection money. Please, can you just leave me alone? I already said it wasn't like that. I'm not even a Yakuza. I really just want to talk for a minute. Talk about what? Touch upon a real estate. I'm doing a little investigation. And I'd like you to tell me what you know. Anything is fine. What I know isn't a hell of a lot. I'd prefer never to deal with those guys again. That's... they're terrifying. Terrifying how? What did... what did they do to you? It's not even what they did. They just knew about me. Like, everything about me. Like what? My parents' home address, my daughter's school, where I, where I source all the cafe supplies, who all my customers are. With that much ammo, they didn't have to do anything. 
And to top it off, they're not even Yakuza. At least with that lot, you know what to expect. I see. And where would I go if I want to meet the guy from Tachibana's office who paid you that visit? They're probably still there. Finishing what they started. Still where? The Hakua Brilligon Shifuku Street. The place my cafe was in. They've driven most of the tenants out, so the place is practically empty. But there was one stubborn guy who said the only way he was leaving was in a casket. And he's still there? Probably. They were making him all kind of sweet deals, but he turned down every last one. If he's still there now, Tachibas boys will be there too. Go have a look if you really want to get mixed up with them. Alright, thanks, I appreciate it. Tachibana's been running tenants out of the Hakua building of, uh, on uh, Shishifuku Street. It's worth checking out. To save the game using the area. And there we go. So, I'm gonna quit the game. Return the title, yes. Yes, I am sure. Sega! Really, Yakuza use a gamepad. They sure do. No. Nope. I'm gonna quit the game. There we go. Then we're gonna double check to see if anyone is streaming. It doesn't look to be the case. But I don't know. Nope, no one is streaming. Okay, then I'll just end it here. So thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. It was quite fun. It was quite fun I mean, uh, streaming this game again. So uh, I hope to see you next time I stream, which likely tomorrow. No guarantees, but again, likely. We'll see. We'll see. So thanks again for watching. Say for your one, and I hope to see you next time. Bye, everybody.